Alrighty, hello Identity 5 Gamers. Today is the first day of Koa Tournaments. That's right. So if you're wondering why I'm streaming at 1.30 a.m., <laughs> it's because the very first uh, day of tournament is happening in two minutes. As we can see right over here, Call of Abyss, the Japan League, uh, looks like it's already begun. It has already begun this stream. As you can see, the little characters are uh, are moving around here. So we're going to have a bit of a watch party tonight. I don't know how long this is going to be. Because uh, I usually go to sleep today. <laughs> this, is, this is the time This is the time I usually go to sleep. Like, usually around 1.32. I usually go to sleep around this time. Uh, so I don't, know, I don't know how long I'm going to be able to stream this. Depending on, um, you know, my stamina. But I'm excited to watch some games. It's usually really long. I'm well aware. I'm well aware. Don't worry. I I, I have I have sat through plenty. Cause like look at how long these usually go. Six hours, four hours, eight hours. The the chances of us actually watching all the matches are pretty low. Cause I'd have to probably stay up till like seven in the morning to do that, and I don't know if I can do that. But um I wanna at least like, you know, watch watch the first few matches and whatnot. So I've kinda got a system set up here. Well, I almost had one. Um, let me go back here, actually. I need to adjust this, so... so <laughs> sorry, I'm, I'm getting things worked out here. This, this is gonna be a lot more of a... A lot more, mo lot more chill stream, for sure. Uh, cause we're gonna... We're, there's gonna be a lot of downtime in the stream while we're waiting for matches, so... Um... I, don't, I have to keep an eye on it, for, uh... For sure. But there, there's two sets today. There are two sets today. Is there a video coming for Explorer's character? Yes, there is. Today is Kurt's birthday. There will be a video uh, later today. Probably late today, uh, considering uh, I'm, I'm up now. But there, there will be an Explorer video. I've, ha I've had such a good idea for an Explorer thumbnail, too. I'm not going to use it for the character day, but when I when I do buy Kurt, which I was actually going to buy Kurt soon, but this uh, character day is probably going to push, uh, push me buying Kurt back. Okay, so I, I need I need to um, uh, ig ignore it. No, you can't hear that. Never mind. I, I just plugged my freaking phone into my computer. All right, what I need to do is I need to pull up the uh, the stream on my phone because I I have two mo how, how I stream is I have two monitors, but I'm gonna be keeping track of chat and also like the game. All right, so for some reason they decided <laughs> to um to to start the stream 30 minutes early. <laughs> Well, there's gotta be no games, so I guess um, I guess now now what we do, I, I'm I'm getting set up here. Sorry, hold on. Now what we do, I have to set up my phone here. So now now I have the phone, the now I have the stream on my phone, so I can see when exactly, uh, this is happening. So what we're gonna do, is, is we're we're gonna we're gonna play some, we're just gonna play some matches. We're just gonna play some matches, um, while while we while we wait for the stream to start. I I think I think that's good. Um, Cause we we got time, we we got we got time, we got plenty of time. Um, let me see here. Oh, okay. Sorry, Zeus is DM me something very cursed. <laughs> okay. <laughs> we we could watch some spectate the pros, but I I kind of want to play some matches because uh, I need points. My my weekly limit points are pretty low, so I'm gonna I'm gonna play some listen smiley. Uh, I'm gonna I'm gonna play some listen smiley. <laughs> so yeah, I know it's a very late stream, and I know a lot of people are probably not going to be able to tune into this, but um, I at least wanted the first day of Koa to be like, uh, to, to be the one that we, um, oh look, my, my listen smiley is already ready. <laughs> uh, I, I just need points. I, I just need points. The match time was a little too quick. Uh, yeah, whenever I play Hunter, I get a match within like two seconds. Yo, Makoto? That's cool. Makoto Niji Makord. That's cool. Don't hit him, hurt him with the listen smiley. My my listen smiley is is my best character. Well, no, that's a lie. Actually, my S one Ripper is. Um, but listen smiley is my second most powerful character. My night watch, my my night watch is not not in my uh, top ten strongest characters. There are so many stronger characters that I have <laughs> when it comes to Hunter. Um, such as my no persona web Leo. Uh, listen, listen, smiley. Uh, <laughs> so very good. So yeah, we're we're gonna we're gonna. <laughs> we're 
I do have. I think I have insolence. Uh, I think my. I think my build is insolence confined. I think. I'm pretty sure that's what my build is. I don't know if this is really good on Dankwoods though, because the thing with Dankwoods, there's so many two-story areas. So, I don't know how good this is gonna go. But we we have we have 30 minutes to stall. Oh, they're playing. Okay, they're they're playing like little. Uh, they're playing like little trailers and oh, they're playing the Crimson trailer for the Priestess skin. Yeah, they they they're playing little trailers before uh before Koa begins. So we got we got time. We got time. We got time. Um, and if you're if you're watching the stream. Um, you know, as a VOD right now in the future, um, you, you, I'll, I'll probably leave some timestamps so that you can skip to the matches. That way it's just, you know, easier for people to view. Um, you can skip all my boring matches here. They are going to put down the pallet, which is kind of annoying. Uh, but I, I can kind of just farm Psyche here. Um, she shouldn't be too hard. What is Melly doing here? Oh. Thanks for the presence, I guess? What? Guys? Hello? Pull back bees, smart. She's smart, yes. Okay, she's good. All right, wait. That. Oh, do you have time? I have to. Mm. Bruh. <laughs> nice. She's good. She's good. Let's go, Melly Gaming. Melly, very smart. Sorry, Melly, but you are at half health. You don't know the power of my listen smiley now, do you? Oh, unfortunate. Yo, I'm I'm one hit away from max presence. Let's go. Uh, we can hit bees there. Set up our confined space. Oh, yep, we do indeed have the confined space. Coordinator might be nearby? No, I don't see cord. Let's see. We'll find her with listen. Or maybe we won't find her with listen. Nope, somebody's coming in. Hmm. Are they actually counterplaying listen right now? I'll, whoever this is, I'm going to kill them. Is that patient? Take this! Ooh, my listen smiley. My listen smiley gaming. Too powerful, too powerful. Mm. See, we're, we're wasting time with Tide like this, dude. All, all the Tide time. I see the gun, I see the gun. Can I drop? I can't drop in time. I don't have the fast pickup. But it's okay. I got dash, I got dash, I got dash, I got dash. You're done. Boop. There we go. See, that gun meant nothing. That gun bought, like, what, 10 seconds, maybe? That's it. That's all it bought. Listen, Smiley's too powerful. Listen, Smiley's too OP. Well, it's, it's specifically Listen, Smiley. No, no, I saw that psych heal. Oh, there's a pallet there. I don't know Dankwoods, bro. I don't know anything about Dankwoods. Oh, boy. Well, now we got Melly here again. Don't vault that, please. I, I would cry if he vaulted that. You still have bees? Really? Well, your bees should be gone with this. Okay, her bees are completely gone now. Because I, I did hit that many times. She's running knee jerk. Um, let me let me do this here. D I canceled my own dash. I pressed it too many times because of the freaking... I, I was just like trigger happy on it. And now they're all healed. <laughs> Wait, did Psych? Oh, you're one of those. I see. I see, I see. I see. I see. I know I know how I know what you want to do here. Smart, but now you're just gonna get hit here. Boop! Don't trap yourself. Don't go back there, you'll trap yourself. Come on, Melly, don't do this. Don't do this, Melly. Are you gonna swing? Yeah. How do I swing? Hi, coordinator. Uh, take a hit. Awesome. Cool. Well, they're extending her kite, which is good. I'm glad that they're keeping Melly alive. That's that's good of them. No, this is Melly's OP. You guys just don't know. You guys just don't know. Like she's just pallet. The only the only thing she's doing is pallet spamming. She doesn't know what to do. That's why she's pallet spamming. Like without without the pallet, she doesn't know what to do. She's she's terrified. I might listen, Smiley. Because listen, Smiley is too good. He's OP. Like, he literally is, like, unstoppable. Like, what are they going to do now, huh? Now that I have Listen? Because I'll know all their locations. Yeah. One's over there. One's over there. Okay, we're good. We're good. All we do is just... Boom! Listen Gaming. See, he can get to the chair faster, but, like, I can catch up. I'll just use my Blink. All right, he just gave that to me. <laughs> He's trying to bait a chair hit, but I was patient. I mean, actually, no, he's patient. <laughs> Funny. Laugh, please. Subscribe. <laughs> oh, boy. This is it, bro. This is Listen Smiley for you. I don't know why they're not Cypher rushing. I'm not sure why they're not Cypher rushing. And now none of them can heal. Or rescue safely. It's over. Smi Smiley's too good. Hold on, wait. Let's listen here. Let's listen. Let's listen here. Mm. Ah, there you are. 
Don't even think about it. <laughs> That's funny. You tried it. You tried it. I can respect that. I can respect that. She's going to vault that because she's scared. She's going to vault back because she's terrified. Then we break pallet and my, my thingy is charged up and then she's dead. What you know about my Lucy Smiley? Easy, bro. Easy. <laughs> Listen, Smiley, bro. Listen, Smiley. It's that easy. It's that easy, bro. Like, you think I'm joking? You think I'm joking? No. Griffin's, by the way. Griffin's, by the way. I'm not... Did I say? Did I... Did I... <laughs> did I misspeak? <laughs> my list is smiley, bro. <laughs> what can I say? Listen, smiley. What what other meme builds do you guys want to see? You got you guys. Let's let's do some meme builds. What do you guys want to see? You want we want to see Joseph? My Joseph's trash. But we want to see Joe. What 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 build? What build do we want to see? Patroller Geisha. I don't have Geisha. I don't have Mary either. It, it, we have to do. We have to make do. Actually, I do have. I do have Bloody Queen. Hold on. Somebody wanted Patroller BQ. What's the build though? What's the build? You guys can choose the build. I don't have Dream Witch. What? What's the build? We have 40 seconds. Peeper. Wait. Peeper. Want, people want to see Peeper Joseph. Okay. We'll, we'll 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 do Peeper Joseph. Then then we'll do Mary next time. Um, build. Trump window and trump card. Okay, so we have we have confined space and trump card. Yep, exactly what we need. All right, Peeper Joseph, we got it. <laughs> On hospital, and I'm visiting them. Oh boy, Peeper Joseph, this is this is gonna be four escape. I guarantee you, I guarantee that this is four escape. But what do we swap to? That's the question. What do we swap to? If we start with peepers, what do, what do we swap to? Oh, cool, a camera's right in front of me. This is awesome. I'll set it up immediately, bro, so they have no time to hide. Boom. Easy. All right, let's get in here, Jojo. Let's find these serves. Dang, I forgot how fast Joseph is. He's kind of crazy with it. Switch to listen. You want to see listen? Blink. Hmm. We got to find somebody, bro. Should have brought insulin. That's what I should have done. Should have brought insolence. I don't know what I was thinking. Bro. I don't know where the key spawns are. Where is everybody? <laughs> this is truly my Joseph. No way they're all hiding, right? Where is everybody? Hold up. Somebody's gonna be at the cipher, I guarantee it. Ugh. Bruh. Where is everybody? Hmm. This sucks. I haven't found a single person. <laughs> Not a single person. This sucks. Oh, hey, cool. Uh, bonk. Awesome. We're winning. And it doesn't matter. I, I counter her. Wait, I counter like this whole team. Bro, they can't do anything. You can drink, but it's not going to matter. It doesn't matter. Let me set up my confined space. All right. Yeah, she can, she can she can do that, but it's not going to matter. I kill her anyways. Yep. I set up confined space. We straight chase. My mirror world's almost ready. I'm going to spam the mirror world so they won't be able to cypher rush me. Yeah, she got the heal off, but at what cost? Boop. There we go. So yeah, I don't even know why you bothered because all you did by doing that is decrease your decoding speed if you do get rescued. Okay. Where's the nearest cam? There's the nearest cam. We drop peeper and then... We set up cam. Beautiful. All right, so they got a single cipher done. That's impressive. Here we go. We got cheese. Hey, buddy. Go into. That's where I saw somebody over there. Boop. All right. I don't know if I have the trait that makes my attack recovery faster at the, whatever it is. All right. There's the tide. Um, she's actually not opting to go into mirror world. I don't know why she's not doing that. Drop pallet. Drop pallet. Not dropping pallet. I can see you. That doesn't hit, really? That's crazy. I should have dropped a peeper. If I dropped a peeper, that was a win right there. Here we go. And... Where are you going? Where are you going? Okay, they did save her in Mirror World. That's good. You're risking your job for me? What? 
Okay, that was just bad. That was actually just bad. Don't pallet spam me. Um, I should be able to... No, don't drop... That's a that's a death pallet. You don't want to drop that. That that does that that pallet literally does nothing for you. That pallet literally does nothing for you, bro. If I had blink, this would be so much easier. Oh, if I had blink, bro. Okay, I don't know why I'm straight chasing. That's fine. Dang! He breaks pallets fast. No wonder I was so scared in that one video. Hey, merchant. What what are we doing? Let me drop a. Oh nope. Let me get rid of that. Nope. You guys can get the rest of you, but I don't I don't want to I don't want to have any of that happening here. All right, let's see. Uh, who's decoding? Puppeteer? Hmm. Alright, well this is- this is- I'm somehow getting Cypher Rush as a Joseph. Yeah, that's crazy, isn't it? Oh, hi. You just threw. Are you good? She actually just threw by doing that. I don't know what she was thinking. Alright, we set up cams. Cypher Rush. Block that off. Beautiful. Come here. Alright, I see somebody over there. Actually, I can just go chair on the Cypher. I'll just go chair on the Cypher, force him off of it. Hey guys, it's me. Oh, dang. That's crazy. I actually can't believe that. Alright, uh, we go after Gravekeeper and we can secure a tie here. Did he go into mirror? He wanted to, yeah, he wanted to thing. Uh, where exactly are you, though? I know you're in here, but where? Oh. What? Wait, Puppeteer was here? What the heck? That's crazy. You know, I should maybe uh, do the thing my character is made for. That's a good idea. Here we go. <laughs> Make sure to use my time jump. I, I'll be completely honest with you. I still have no idea how to use it properly. Not a, not a clue. Not a clue in the slightest. They're probably just going to finish the Cypher when they when they uh, die here. Um, they're going to try and rescue themselves. Here, let me see. Can I use it? I'm so good at Joseph. <laughs> All right. Uh, let's see. Hmm. Are they going to be at this cipher? It's the closest one. Hmm. Let's see. They're over here then. Where is the... Where is the toy merchant? <laughs> Where are they? <laughs> Bro, this is literally just me playing Joseph. Where is everybody? Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Can I please... Oh, they're in hospital. Are they really hiding in hospital? Are, you... are we really doing this? We're all in hospital. Oh my gosh, dude! Fall down to the second. Fall down to the first floor. It'd be funny. Fall down to the first floor. It'll be funny. All right. Well, I, I obviously go after Toy Merchant here. Hey. Hey. I should probably set up cameras, huh? I make this. Yep. It's not primed. We're good. Let's see. What are they working on? Is it Shack? Oh, they are working. They're go. Okay, they're working on Shack. Yeah. Use your jump card to find them, please. I still don't know how to play Joseph. Fun fact. I still don't know how to play Joseph. <laughs> okay, they healed. They puppeteer healed, but it doesn't matter. <laughs> it doesn't matter. Oh, it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. I'm pretty sure I still kill you, even if you are, Lewis. Um, actually, I can just wait. No, wait, you're still die. Never mind. I don't know how to play Joseph, apparently. All right. Um... Welp, we swap, he rescues, I'm bad, he can't use Lewis, he's dead. That Cypher surely shouldn't be ready, I'm going to chair Puppeteer, Toy Merchant hasn't been rescued in Mirror Mode, so she'll go down, we're good, boop a da boop, there we go, and I swap in case he's in here, yup, predictable, very predictable, very predictable, alright, then we go back to the Cypher, Wee! bonk, um, he should be here, right? Is he in the real world? Oh, it's kind of close, though. I can't even lie. Oh, he went out. Oh, dang, you're far! He's gonna try and rescue them! Too bad. I probably should've used my trick card there, huh? Probably should've used that there, huh? Um... Alright, he went into shovel, so now he's useless. You still die, even with Lewis. And now they're gonna go try and rush the Cypher! <laughs> Oh, I can't believe it, dude. How How is this working? How is this working? Drop pallet. Yup. I break it super fast. And she might be able to make this. No, she doesn't. Dang, she makes that. That's crazy. All right, well, she's still dead. Boop. And I'll chair. I'll chair. Even, even if I lose, I'll chair. I, I can't keep letting them get back up. 
Even if she has no self heal, I don't want them to borrow time and rescue. Easy, bro. How, how long is this? Hold trick card for two seconds. Don't move your camera whichever direction it faces where the survivor is. All right. One. Two. Oh. <laughs> well, not needed, I suppose. Uh, Jojo! Woo! How? No, we cherish shock here. Jojo. Bruh. Jojo. <laughs> All right, cool. Somehow that was 4K. We somehow got that. Anyways, my Joseph sucks, but they, I guess, they have puppeteers so they can't heal, so that makes things harder for them. They, they had two useless characters, so, yeah. We did it. Yeah. You just have to tap it. Okay, somebody said hold it down for two seconds. Again, I don't play Joseph enough to actually know. All right, what's the, what's the next meme build? We said we had Patroller BQ, but that's like kind of optimal. And I also don't play Mary. My Mary's complete garbage. I've literally played her on her birthday and then that one time in Zeus's stream and then never again. <laughs> yeah, literally. Dude, I love I love it when people meme on the um, meme. I just say like, number one Joseph, pro player, sacred heart. Or it's just like, you know, the gameplay only type videos that you see from like the top or high players. Oh, that's funny. All right, BQ. But what what's, what's the build? What's the build, everybody? What are we thinking? Patroller Ripper to hit those foggies. <laughs> Honestly, it's funny. Oh, that'd be funny. That'd be funny. Confined space insolence. Okay. We want confined inso. All right. Um. Let's see. What else do we want? Fast balloon. Sure. Why not? I don't even know. All right. What? Well, what was the trait though? What was the trait? Excitement. Listen. People want listen? Listen? Peeper, peeper, patroller? Patroller? Okay, I'm seeing a lot of patroller. I'm seeing a lot of patroller. We'll do patroller. My I, my patroller, my, my BQ is trash, but patroller BQ especially? Oh boy. You think I know how to place my mirrors? You think I know how to play? I don't even, dude, Mary confused me so much. I just need one, I just need more practice with the character. <laughs> I 100% do not know how to play this character. If I can at least cure a tie, I think I'd, I think I'll be happy with that. I don't have trump cards, so all I have is controller. Oh boy, oh boy, Mary, what are we doing? Jeez. All right, let's see here. Hit a survivor after swapping positions with mirror image. Okay, that shouldn't be too hard. Let's see. Let's just um, let's mirror over there. Surely somebody's over there, right? Yeah. See, this is what I'm talking about. I always run into nothing. Oh, prisoner. Awesome. Okay, we found the prisoner, actually. This is good. He's gonna drop the pallet. I'm not in it. I'm not in it. I waited. I wait. I respected it. I respected it, bro. Whoa! Jeez, it's so weird seeing fast break pallet Mary. Um, all right. What we want to do here is... Yep, respect the pallet. And then we drop patroller. Here we go. Patroller gaming. Yeah, go ahead and hide behind it, bro. So now what we do here is uh, we set up the mirror, and that was a terror shock. Yo, hold on, my Mary's crazy. Yo, that insulin's coming in clutch, though. <laughs> oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. Oh, that was funny. That was actually funny. Okay. Was that patroller? <laughs> you deployed to using controller. <laughs> hey, hey, hold on, hold on. I'm gonna, I'm gonna mirror that freaking long portal. Stop that. Quit that. I don't, I want. Can I mirror? Hold on. I can hit that right. Hit the long portal, doofus. The long portal. Hit it. Oh my gosh. I can't aim, bro. And now mercenary gets the free rescue. <laughs> it's okay. Patroller's back up in 40. We'll be fine. Wait, he's gonna try and make it to the long portal, isn't he? Nah. Hold on. I have to. I have to just go. Bro, he's got a sister. I have to just kill the long portal first. What are you doing? No, I can't. I'm not letting him get there. He went over here, didn't he? Where'd he go? No, that's mercenary. Where'd he go? Nah, Buddha. I hate priestess. Where'd he go? That's it. You're dead. You're done. Why are you? Hello. 
Uh, uh. All right. Well, now, now the priestess has 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 making is is has brought about. Pfft, how do you play, Mary? Uh. How, oh, there you are. Wait, I can use the flippy thing. That did not help at all, bro. I don't know how to play this character. Patroller, do your thing. Jerry, let's go. Okay. Geez, she's far. It's fine. I'll catch up with Patroller. You got nowhere to go. <laughs> Jerry, cancel the freaking portal. Let's go. <laughs> oh, boy. Well, Prisoner being out on the loose is annoying, but at least Mercenary's Tide is gone. I was just... Dude, the stupid long portal is what made things so annoying there. That's all That's all it was. It's like stupid Priestess on Moonlit. All right. Let's see here. Wait. He elbow padded, didn't he? To avoid my mirror. Meaning that he's coming in. He should be like right here, yeah? I freaking called it, dude. Oh my gosh, I'm so good. All right, he's using all his elbow pads. That's annoying. Bro, stop using the, your character's abilities. Oh, I hate these pallets. Disrespect. What? What? I wasn't even in it. I wasn't even in it. Nah, I wasn't even in it. Oh, that is so far. What the heck? Uh... Oh, that hits. Okay. Dude, Mary's hitbox is so jank. What the heck? So freaking jank. All right. Now that freaking hack mercenary has no more elbow pads, we're good. Oh, I don't like these pallets. I'm going to break these pallets. I have confined. As, again, like I said, as long as I get the, the tie, we should be good. But they can... they can. Nah, I, think, I don't have teleport, though. I have to save I have to save my patroller for endgame. Oh, boy. Hold on. Scare him off the cypher. Wait, is that the prisoner? Where are you, bro? I don't know how to play this character. No, dude, stop. I hate this mercenary. <laughs> I'm just trying to freaking stop. <laughs> it's too much to focus on. I don't even know how to, oh my gosh. I need my mirror. I'm just gonna wait for mirror. I know it's like not optimal, but I just need to wait for mirror, bro. There we go. Oh, I, dude. Pop. There's the pop, yep. Uh, so annoying, bro. That stupid mercenary. No, my music. Oh, it's on. It's on loop. We're good. All right. Well, like at least kill. Dude, this priestess mercenary. Why am I fighting like actual meta? Nah, Bruh. This is so annoying. Priestess mercenary, man. I hate this comp. Uh, and I barely even know how to mirror. <laughs> bro. How do people play this character? I don't know what I'm doing. Uh, I swear if Dungeon's here, bro, I'm gonna scream. It is, bro. Please, I'm so slow. I don't know how to use mirror. Oh my gosh. I swear she has speed pillar or something. Yo! Nah. How do you do anything with this character? How do people get accurate? See, this is what I mean. I get stuck on everything. Oh my gosh. Could find space, surely. Mirror, please do something. I literally can't do anything. I'm actually going to lose. i actually going to get four escaped because I literally can't hit my mirror. <laughs> oh my gosh. Dude, my Bloody Queen is so bad. Oh my gosh. Uh, it's so annoying, bro. Literally anybody else but Priestess and Mercenary, and we were fine there. We were actually fine. We would have got the tie. But it had to be Priestess Mercenary, bro. It had to be Priestess Mercenary. Oh, that's so annoying. They were hacking. Yeah, they were hacking. Dude, I literally... The Prisoner, it was free down and then Long Portal. So I couldn't even hit him because he would have got the free escape with Long Portal. And then the freaking Mercenary with the elbow pad. Double elbow pad, by the way. Double elbow pad came in. Oh, that's so annoying, bro. That's so annoying. Well, it's fine because I don't even play that character, so. But that's what I mean. Like, how do all the Marys like get such accurate mirrors when all I do is walk into walls? I just don't understand. Like, I swear they can walk in a straight line for so long, but whenever I do, I just run into stuff. I don't understand how they do it, bro. I don't understand. Anyway, we only have two minutes left, so I don't think I'm gonna play another match because we should be good here. And I'm not using my dice. Um, 
I I'm not using my dice here because the, the next season is in 20 days. So, place mirrors to the side? To the side? I don't know. <laughs> Two more minutes time for the Hell Ember. Uh, actually, you know what's funny? I should I should mention this. Uh, I, I was watching um, I was watching the the latest video put out. Um, this this video here. Uh, I, I know I know Zeus covered it, but I. Um, it was pretty interesting. They they did like a little um, like all, all they like covered all the buffs and adjustments that have happened like recently and like what what is going to be seen in Koa. Which is pretty cool, right? But the thing is, two characters that showed up here that are illegal in tournaments are uh, Novelist and uh, and Percy. So I'm I'm wondering if we're gonna see uh, if we're gonna see these characters show up. It could be pretty cool if we do. Anyways, we got we got about a uh, we got, we got about one minute, so we'll we'll wait for this match. It's gonna, there's gonna be a lot of prep time for it though, so the match probably isn't even gonna start until like 10 minutes from now or something. The side of survivors not behind them? I see. Well, a lot of the Marys, what they'll do is they'll pincer me. That's what I thought you were supposed to do. But again, I, I literally don't play that character. I, I've, I've played Mary like maybe like six times ever. And I still don't know how to use Mirror correctly. I'm sure it just takes a little bit of practice. Once I can get my mirrors down, it shouldn't be that hard. Novelist still getting banned even after a rework? That's what I thought. Um, Eli O oh, on the uh, commentator tournament said that Novelist was banned for that tournament. Um, the one that he was like competing in. But apparently, allegedly, because of that video, it's making me think that uh, Percy and Novelist will be uh, will be available. So I'm not sure. In an open area, I see. Okay, okay. I mean, again, I don't, I don't play Mary. I should probably practice. I want to get good. I want to get like at least average with every character. But so many of the hunters like just take so much, uh, so much. Rare. Okay. Okay. This, this is just the intro. This is just the intro. We've, we've already seen this. Never mind. <laughs> this, this is just the intro. We, we've already seen this. Hopefully, Opera Singer's banned. Uh, Opera Singer will be available in round one. We're most likely going to watch two Opera Singer matches first. That's the thing. Uh, Opera si there's no there's no Hunter bans uh, at the start. The survivors do not get any um, Hunter bans at the very first match. What I find to be so weird, though, is that that new Hunter, the Shadow, Ivy, or the Shadow of Time and Space, whatever her full name is, it's so weird that they just kind of shadow dropped her and is like, yeah, she's coming out in like 20 days, by the way. Like with Puppeteer, they announced him like, what, two months before with Fool's Gold? Like, Fool's Gold had like a lot more time, right? I feel like Fool's Gold had like a month or a month and a half or something. Um, should I make a Joseph guide for you? <laughs> no, I'm good. I know I know the standard basics of Joseph. I'm just really bad at Trump. I'm uh, doing the, not the Trump card, the, 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 the full presence ability. I'm really bad at using the full presence ability. Otherwise, it's like Joseph's pretty easy. A whole essay on how to play Joseph. That's funny. Yeah, I, I wanted new hunter to be Melly as well. But pe people always say that they announce characters at the end of the at the end of tournament. So I'm wondering if we're gonna uh, if we're gonna see Hunter Melly. I really hope that we do. I really hope that we do. Also, yeah, Fool's, Fool's Gold is legal in Koa. He's legal. Puppeteer is not, though. We are not going to see any Puppeteer. Not 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 a single Puppeteer, I believe, for all of Koa. But Fool, Fool's Gold is uh, is legal. The only thing is, Fool's Gold is not very powerful. He he's toward he's toward the low end. Most most people consider him to be uh, pretty mid, which is kind of sad because I, I think he's cool. I think I think Foolish is pretty cool. Free my boy Puppeteer. The thing with Puppeteer is he's he's only been out for like a month. He, he's only been out for a month, so he's yeah. Lewis is not ready for this tournament, unfortunately. This is this is not a Lewis is ready moment, honestly. Okay, so when the match starts, I'm gonna turn up the music a little bit or the, the audio, so we'll be able to to hear the commentators a little bit. Um, and I'll I'll have to rely on you guys to uh, let me know if it's uh, too loud or whatnot. 
And I'm, I'm surprisingly doing just fine. Even though I usually am like asleep right now, I'm honestly doing pretty fine. I don't know if it's just the hype or whatever, um, but I'm doing just fine right now. I am doing just fine. Yeah, Fool's Gold early game is so weak. It's so weak. Like, the, the, when, when they, okay, so, hold on. I, I, I have sights on it. I can just go back and switch. So the thing about Fool's Gold, right, is, um, the, the freaking dash ability, this, the, the thing that's like, oh, it's, okay, the commentators are there now. Um, but you know how he has like that huge thing, like his cooldown, like, uh, it's like, yeah, six, six seconds for the, the freaking axe cooldown. And then that, that basically means he can get a massive speed boost every six seconds, right? But the thing is, it's only in a straight line. Unlike, unlike uh, hunters like Nightwatch um, or Anne, with, with the jumps, you can't curve it. Um, and with Nyads, the thing about Nyad that makes her better than Fool's Gold, is she can cancel her dash. If Nyad couldn't cancel her dash, I guarantee you she'd be much worse. She would be so much worse. But that's the thing that Fool's Gold suffers from. He can't he can't cancel the dash. Once he, once he's in it, he's committed. He's going. That's why you'll see so many people like with uh, impatient Fool's Gold. All you have to do is if they throw the pickaxe at you, you just run back towards them because they're gonna use it, and then you just you just trade places with each other. It's pretty funny. It, it, it's pretty funny. Anyway, we're we're back on the uh, the tournament here. So the, the the commentators are they're ready. We we got the I, li I like looking at the little back. I like the little sets that they have because obviously they're just green screened in. But I like the little uh. Uh, the little, the little freaking stuff all around, the little plant or whatever. What do, you, what do you call those things? I don't know what that is. What's, what is he doing? He's like, oh, look at this desk. Ooh. <laughs> oh boy. Oh hi, Noel. How's it going? Slept for like five hours now. I'm locked in. I, I'm probably not gonna get too much sleep today, uh, just because of all this. Watching these tournaments through the game gives you golden apples. Oh, right. Hold on. Is that available right now? Let me see. Let me see. Let me see. Let me see. It's not. It's not available right now. That's weird, huh? Why can't I do this? Does anybody else have this? Or is there like a setting that I accidentally turned off? Um. Huh. You have to change your language to Japanese. Oh, I'm not doing that. <laughs> But I was able to watch Japanese... I was able to do this for IVL, though. I, for Japanese turns in IVL, I was able to do this. That's weird. Yeah, I, I, I want to know how much apples I have. I think I have a good amount of apples, so... That's, that's why this is kind of weird. Anyway, there, there's the schedules. So it's basically... So for those who haven't seen the schedule yet, I did post it uh, earlier on my community page. Um, but he, he, here's, here's the schedule that we got. So... Friday, Saturday, Sunday is the Japan Division qualifiers, and they, they last for three weekends. Um, so there's going to be a lot of Japan games. There's going to be a lot of Chinese games uh, that happen from the 9th to the 31st. So a lot a lot of Chinese uh, games there. And then it looks like we get Southeast Asia and NAEU. So NAEU is going to be on Saturday, Sunday uh, of next week. So that's going to be pretty exciting. We're going to see like, some B4U or something. And then uh, everything after that is the finals in April. So... We get like every weekend of March is just like all the everybody facing off against each other, and then um, everybody comes together on the the group stage for a whole week and a half. I guarantee you that week of April, dude, it's gonna go crazy. And then of course the uh, the last few days of um, or the la the first few days of May rather are the finals. So yeah, let me delete that. There we go. It's gonna be fun. Playing on Asia server when? Uh, maybe maybe today. I don't even know. I don't play much on my Asia server account because it's it's laggier and it's not my main account. And I, I already have my hands full with doing uh, just just reaching the weekly limit in this game. I'd spend so many hide and seeks. Yeah, I would love to see Hunter Melee for Koa finals, but it might it most likely will be a survivor character. Uh, cause they, they usually, to my knowledge at least, I am still new to this community, but to my knowledge, I don't think they ever really release two hunters at once, right? I, I'm pretty sure it's usually, uh, serves, like a lot more serves, cause there's like, what, 26 hunters in the game, 40, 42, 43 serves? I don't even know. Bro is online all the time. It's just cause I just leave IDV open. I, li I literally leave it open all night and I just have it open cause it's just easier to... Not, not log it, log in or whatever. 
I need to change this music, dude. I've been listening to this music for like a whole hour. Almost an hour. Let's see here. I'm gonna play some non copyrighted music. Hmm. How about this? Let me get some Elite Four. Do I like my Dutch fans? I guess. Why wouldn't I? What? I can get Amazon cards? That's crazy. I can get a... Is that a, is that a 20 set of dice in-game? Or is that a 20 set of dice for real? <laughs> Let's get a D20 and just roll it, bro. Do I play Final Fantasy? Uh, I've... Uh, very little, but I do want to play more of it. I know the new game released. I really want to play that, but I don't have a PS5, so rip. I can't afford a PS5. I can't. I can't just drop five hundred dollars for a single game. Orpheus so is so bugged. That's why he. Well, that's that's why he. Yeah. What when he was in his older form? That's right. He he when he was like before his adjustment where he actually took control of the hunter for five seconds. Uh, that was really buggy. Um, but then his little swap ability, that was also buggy, so they didn't allow that either, even after his adjustment, I'm pretty sure. Uh, but now I think he's legal. And we, I don't know even, I don't know if we're gonna see much Novelist, because... I, I think Novelist, unfortunately, is still a mid-tier character, so... If, if he does come out, he's gonna show up in the later rounds. He's not gonna be round one. Round one is just gonna, we're just gonna be seeing Opera Singer versus, like, Gardener, uh... Lawyer, Wildling, Officer, um, Acro, Anti, Patient, like that kind of stuff. It, it's just, it's just the, it's just gonna be like the round one comps that we see all the time. Isn't IDV isn't just mainstream in NAU? Oh, no, yeah, I, I, Identity 5 is not very popular in NAEU, to my knowledge. It's it's far bigger in, um, in in Asia, to my knowledge. Which is a little sad, honestly. I wish more people liked this game. It's funny, I, I, I tried some of, my, some of my friends this game, they thought it looked stupid. They just thought it looked like a, like a cringy, uh, Dead by Daylight ripoff. <laughs> Thief in first round, you know, low, high. I mean, no, he's not gonna come out against Opera, but Thief does actually show up. I can't. Thief is actually a specialist pick that we see sometimes. I can't even lie. Okay, let me let me put this up. Low. He he actually does show up sometimes. I think he shows up like against Wax Artists or something. I've seen I've seen I've seen Thief versus Wax Artists on Chinatown a few times, so we we could actually see him. Thief can cook sometimes. Thief Thief, thief can cook. But he's pretty bad, in my opinion. Oh? Wait, what the? Oh, oh, okay, these are, okay, 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 hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Okay. Alright, this should, this should be a good vibe. Obviously, they're speaking a different language, so I, I can't understand them. Um, but that, that looked to be... That, see, this is, the, this is the first set we got here. The first set is um, Axis versus WL, or AXIZ versus WL. So we have we have 200 players. And I saw Melly, that's why I got excited. <laughs> that's, that's why I got excited. Oh, boy. So it looks like they play Hermit. And I like how they have the stats here. They, they have, like, the stats that they have down here. Average Terra Shocks 0.41. I guess in all of their games. They don't really get many Terra Shocks. Well, I guess it's a Hermit. When does a Hermit ever get Terra Shocks? He's so dummy slow. He's a walking hunter. Plus, he just stuns. He never really gets Terra Shocks unless the hunters are, or the serves are bad. Yeah, the, the win rate, though, not that crazy. But again, this, this game is dummy survivor-sided. So. Well, unless it's Opera. Oh, Opera's hunter sided, but every other every other hunter is mostly survivor sided. Alright, next up we have Mercenary with a 0% win rate. <laughs> oh, that's funny. That's funny, that's funny. But yeah, these I guess these must be like the the, the character they're the players' specialist characters that we usually see them win. Zero percent is insane. No no I, I think okay, okay. <laughs> it's not actually zero percent, but I'm pretty sure the zero percent is because um 
There's like a reason behind it. I think it's just because either this is like a new player that hasn't. You know, to be honest, I honestly don't know. I know. Okay, they're they're top players. Obviously, they don't win zero percent of the time. I don't know what the win rate necessarily means. <laughs> but um. One of them is Aziz all account. Well, if you see that Ripper, bro, I told you, if you see that Ripper. 25% win rate with the Prospector. Escape. I think the escape rate is more what we should be looking at here. Average containment time, that's actually pretty bad for a Prospector. Well, I guess he's more of a harassment, but 60 seconds is not great for a Prospector, honestly. He actually has better decoding. That's funny. Yeah, we, we got the Nordster. But I want to see that melee. We're, whenever I say that melee, I want to see that containment time shoot up to like two minutes right now that's what, that's what i need to see two minute two minute melee kites all right we got some will will gaming containment time of 70 seconds win rate 25 percent escape route one third the average decoding progress is like pretty average across the board yeah ripper in tournament Ooh, he's totally that's <laughs> here <laughs> oh boy they're showing my stats hold on let me hold on let me let me see something what are, what are my stats compared to these guys yo i'm better than these guys aren't <laughs> my 43 percent win rate better than theirs Melly, yo Melly, what is that? What the heck? What's that average containment time, Melly? Come on! Oh Melly, you're so cool. I, I hope she goes crazy in this tournament, dude. I hope she goes crazy. This might be the Z's alt account. Yeah, guys, I'm Tuna. Call me Tuna. Thank you. Very much. Oh boy. Oh, I'm excited, dude. I'm excited. I've never done a live version of this before. They made a typo. It's supposed to be 250%. Oh, yeah, the win rate? Yeah, that's supposed to be 250% win rate. <laughs> Alright, on the... Ew, Bonbon? Bon? Bro, I'm not rooting for this team. The other team had Melly, and this one has Bonbon. Bon. I'm not rooting for this team. Heck no. Heck, you think I'm rooting for a team with Bonbon bon on it? Nah. Nah, see, they, they got Hermit as, like, their guy. Uh, it's like, this is my main. I'm main Hermit. And then we have our secondary here, Bonbon, bon, that we only bring in when we need a tie. Mechanic is crazy, though. I can't even lie. And Perfumer in this meta? Dang, dude. Wait, that win rate, though. That's kind of high. What the heck? 65%? Dang. I do love Anti. Don't get me wrong. I do love Anti. But thing is, on the hype tier list, Anti is at the top, Bonbon's at the bottom, so it balances out to mid. Like, generally, if you saw my hype tier list, I put Antiquarian at the very top of the survivors and Bomb at the very bottom of the hunters. So it's literally like the hypest versus the lamest. In my opinion, of course. Uh, all, all, all hype opinions are subjective, of course. Except for Bonbon. Bon. That's subjective. <laughs> what the heck? 52% win rate with Perfumer? Nah, something's up. What the heck? Vera? She's cooking? I know, I know these aren't, I know these aren't the player stats, but it's just so weird that they have these tied to like the characters that are right there. Again, I do, I knew, I know these are the player stats. It's just so really, it's just weird to me that they're like, hey, this is the character that has the win right. It's just so weird to see. Spam perfume, yeah, spam perfume. Give the hunter presents. Woo. Isn't it late for it? Yes, it's two in the morning for me. It is two in the morning for me. It is indeed very late. All right, and to Square again. Yo, the average attainment though. Hold on now. All right, the, honestly, the stats of um, WL look much higher. If we're going, if we're going simply based off stats, it looks like WL is going to take this so far. Who are we rooting for? Well, I'm for right for now. I'm rooting for Team Axis or A X I Z or S. A X I Z. Yeah, that, that's the team I'm rooting for because they have Melly. <laughs> I don't, I don't really have any specific teams that I'm rooting for though. Like when, when NAU comes around, I do want to see before you cook. Um, yo, Ichigo is that Ichigo from Bleach? Actually, Zeus actually got me watching Bleach. I've seen ten episodes. Zeus actually convinced me to watch Bleach. I've started watching it. But uh, I don't I don't think um, Team FAV qualified Team Fun and Victory. But they have like two players that play melee all the time, and they actually have really really fun support. I don't know if they qualified though. But if they do, I'll be rooting for them, most likely. 
before you are not gonna cook. They 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 show up to Koa every year though, right? I don't know. Again, this this is like my first uh, Koa experience. So I I, I watched like all the matches from last year's Koa, but I only paid attention to the matches. I didn't pay attention to any of like the the names of people except for the ones that really stood out, like Kuga. Kuga's Night Watch, bro. Oh my gosh, dude. Those those Night Watch games were art in motion, dude. He was so good. He was just so good. I, obviously, I think that was before Night Watch's nurse, but still, dude. Kuga's Night Watch was absolute art. It was so funny, like watching people just cheer for Kuga so much. I loved it, dude. That was that's what that's what got me to start playing Night Watch. Was because I I watched Kuga's games. And I thought I thought they were so hyped that I picked up Nightwatch, and that's why I started playing him. Yeah, I kind I kind of want to see some mech. I, I would like to see some mechanic. I want to see like the niche characters come out. Obviously, here we're gonna be playing some meta, but I want to see like the niche characters come out. I wish I was Kuga. Imagine my Nightwatch gaming was Kuga. Oh, look at the little, look at dude, look at the little animations. I love these. These are cool. All right. So it looks like first map is gonna be Red Church. Am I saying that correctly? Oh, it looks okay. It looks like somebody banned. They banned. Um. They banned. I don't know what that was. They banned something. So we're on, we're on Red Church. Okay, here we go. Here we go. We're about to get in. Let's see. So they're banning coordinator and antiquarian. So obviously that's that's definitely um. That's definitely bans for opera singer. So they're obviously playing opera singer round one. Um, perfume your garner. Yep, yep. Okay. Whoa! The little animations when they come in. That's cool. Whoa! Yo, I love these little animations. That's so cool. Oh, I love these, dude. That's cool. Okay, so they're banning Seer. Uh, Seer, I guess. Mercenary, okay. And Dancer. Dancer, really? Hmm. Alright, let's see. We might see... We can see Wildling. No, Patient. That makes sense. Yeah, it's, it's, round, it's round one comp. Yeah, this makes sense. So for those who don't know how round one comps work, I'm still new to this myself, but the first two characters they select are permanently banned for the rest of the set. That's And the last two characters, Mercenary and Patient, they can be played any other time. But since they select... Oh, that's weird. I guess they shifted. Um, I'm pretty sure it's still Gardner and Perfume are their first choices. So Gardner and Perfume will no longer be available for the rest of the set. That's how that works. That's why they pick like two like niche sort of like lower tier characters. Um, well, Gardner Gardner is niche, but she's good against Opera Singer. That's why you see her being picked round one. So, we're, we're, there's a 90% chance we see Opera Singer. Yeah, there she is. She's already jumping in. Oh, that's cool. I like how they have a, a little platform up there for them. Okay. Yeah. Here we go. The very first official game in Koa is about to start. Here we go. Gardner is A tier. Well, I mean, she she's good against Opera. That's why. She's good against Opera. Pretty standard uh, spawns here. As always, never spawn in corners, everybody. There's, there's very niche situations when you spawn in corners, but for the most part, you never spawn in corners. So, yep, yeah, it looks like they have Patient in the center because they want to have him take the kite. He can get distance. Um, yeah. Perf I thought, yeah, Perfumier, I guess, don't want to take first chase because uh, she'll just feed presence. Obviously, like, Opera's going to get presence no matter what, so it doesn't really matter. But, yeah, pa Patient or Gardner is probably the best two first chase targets here. What years is and why is Vera and Koa? Uh, the reason why, why she's here is just because she can stall. She's just, the thing is, the thing is, Opera is it doesn't matter if you're feeding her presence because she's so broken anyway. She's just there to stall. Opera is stall meta. So I guarantee you, like, we're most likely going to see um, Suicide build on Patient and then, like, three sets of Tide Turners, most likely. If they keep up, like, the current meta. Um, they, they, a lot of people will do, like, borrowed time. Now, it, it's really interesting to see how the meta evolves with Opera Singer because in the beginning when she was first available on, on IVL, most of the time we were just seeing, like, really, really weird builds. They're actually not showing us the builds here from the start. That's a bit sad. I, I hope they change that as the weeks go on. Um, usually they show us the builds here, but they actually don't have them set up. A bit sad. Yeah, well, it was to be four. Actually, I, I forgot. I could do that. Um, here we go. <laughs> uh, will... Hold on. I forgot how to type. Will this be a 4K? 
Yes or no? Start the poll. Alright, so Opera goes into church immediately, flies on through the window, and we're just kind of hiding it out here. People are already on a cipher, it looks like. Yeah, she's chasing chasing the patient. Patient has uh, knee-jerk reflex, tied, tied. Two sets of tied, yeah. Mercenary with tied, gardener with tied. No borrowed time on the gardener. Uh, Perfumer has knee-jerk reflex. Okay, yeah, smack that. Yeah, beautiful. Yeah, actually, he's running the, uh, the Koa skin patient. Let's go. All right, good start to the kite already. Opera has, um, what, what is that trait, actually? Abnormal. She has abnormal. This is abnormal. Okay, interesting, interesting. So she needs to, she's going to have to get this down really fast. Obviously, it's an opera, so she could probably do that. But we're out, we are seeing the abnormal opera. Interesting. Interesting stuff. Let me, let me know how the, uh, the audio sounds for you all, by the way. Good hook. Good hook. That's a beautiful hook, actually. I'm gonna have to steal that. That's a really good hook. Yeah, and if she, if she can't get this down, then she's not gonna have a cypher to abnormal. She needs... Oh, beautiful, beautiful. That was, that was really good. That was really good. I have to give it up. That was just really good. That was really good. Yep, there's the abnormal. Yep, yep, okay. Okay, okay. Yep. That was a really good flip back. Audio is perfect, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah, this this is this is looking uh this could potentially be bad for the survivors because now she has a little bit of extra presence thanks to that terror shock. Um and yet Gardner already transitioning away. Beautiful, perfect, perfect. Mercenary is most likely gonna come on in. Maybe? No? Is he coming? Where is the mercenary? Oh, he's not coming in. Okay. Oh, is he running the Domaki skin? I think he is. I can't tell from that far away, though. He might be running the Domaki Mercenary skin. All right, Gardner's going to come on in. Does she have bubble? We're waiting. We're waiting. Yep, yep. She's actually kind of just letting them get this. Bubble for free rescue. Boop. She actually does hit the patient, gets the pallet on. Not really. Mm. Probably could have waited there. She probably could have waited there a little bit, yeah. Yep, so this this is the opera meta, guys. This is the opera meta. You, t you do first kite, and then you just tide stall. You, you just tide stall. So she hits again for uh, max presence there. And he's going to die off in a quarter to waste as much time as possible. Then the mercenary is going to come on in, use Tide Turner. Um, the Cyphers are not great, actually. The Cyphers could be much better. But yeah, th this is just the opera meta. You just you just do double Tide. Th there's a chance they might even sell this, but I doubt it because they just want to use up the Tide Turner and then just show cut to that. But yeah, the Cyphers are a little... There, there's a lot of work on the Cyphers, but um, if she abnormals another one, it could be bad. We do see the uh, elbow pad there. Gets hit on the mercenary. Yeah, good work. And she can probably make this a double down. Let's see. Yeah, cape. Gonna actually hit the mercenary. No, elbow pad. Good elbow pad. Good elbow pad. Yeah, just pre just prevent that double down. Ooh, good bait. Good bait. She's gonna have to break that. Yeah, you have to break that pallet. You have to break that pallet. One cypher is done. Hold on a minute. Hold on. Tide turner. Okay. Yeah, f five ciphers, but the thing is they all have progress. And yep, she's, she's rushing down the cypher. She's gonna abnormal here. She's gonna abnormal. No? She's gonna go for a hit for... Oh, she messed up. She messed up. She she did not want to do that. I'm, I'm pretty sure she didn't want to do that. Okay. Well, this, this is this is 1k at least so far. The abnormal... She already swapped. Did she swap abnormal? She hasn't swapped off abnormal yet. Okay. Yeah, th this is this is actually looking decent for the survivors. They can at least get one escape from this, like I think guaranteed. Um, yeah, but by the time she makes it to the to the to the broken area, I forget front broken area. So that she's that person is running against that cipher. She does indeed spot out the mercenary's tracks, and he's gonna go down. Doesn't respect the pallet though. Okay, beautiful work from Domaki. We love to see it. And another pallet is here. Mind game, mind game. She respects it this time. And beautiful elbow pad. That's his last elbow pad, though. He's completely out of elbow pads. But the ciphers, the ciphers are actually pretty far along now. Okay, shadow. Beautiful. That was a good bait. That was a good bait. He's dead here. Wow, that actually hits. I actually didn't think that would hit. <laughs> yeah, girl is getting smacked. She, she disrespects these pallets, and I swear. As an opera, I totally understand it, though, because you're just so fast. You just want to keep going and moving and moving and moving. All right, she's gonna have to get aggressive here if she wants to uh, to take this. Um, yeah, mercenary's got a launch air touch. She has to get aggressive. Yep, she knows somebody's in the area. She spots out the perfumer, but the perfume can stall. She has the perfect stalling capabilities. Garner's gonna finish her cipher and go for the rescue. There's the perfume. Yep, just stalling. Gonna maybe head back to the chair. Yep, gonna head back to the chair. But there will be no tinnitus. 
Yeah, they're kind of just selling it out. This is a tie. This is a tie. Well, I can't, I can't say that 100% because it is a mercenary on chair. So the thing is, she hits the mercenary after the borrow time trigger and then TPs and then kills another person because she can leave mercenary on the ground because mercenary heals slowly and he's already been hit several times. So shell shock will be like in full effect. Um, she's checking all around because tinnitus and the rescue is about to happen. Cypher is not quite ready, but it's, it's probably going to be ready just in time. Oh, in basement. Yo, see the stalling, the stalling perfumer, stalling perfumer. And do we hit? Do we hit? It's not ready yet. It's not ready yet. Oh, oh, it's not going to be ready. Terror, terror shock, terror shock. No terror shock? Oh, she just wants to farm the mercenary. They pop. Okay. Yeah, she needs she needs to hit this mercenary and then teleport immediately. Hit the mercenary. She doesn't make that. I think she could have made that. No, I think she definitely could have made that. Oh, she's throwing. She's throwing. She's throwing. She's throwing. No, nope, no, nope, she's it's over. It's over. She this is a tie. It's over. Wait, no, she she made that because she she actually just struck the pallet. Teleport. Yup, yup, beautiful. Okay. And. The pallet is already set up. Okay, hold on, hold on. You have to break the pallet. Yeah, you have to. There's the bubble. Beautiful. The body blocking, though? She can make it to the other pallet. She can make it to the other pallet. Gardner's broken. See, this is why Gardner's good. Base the vault. Base the vault. Vault's back in, but offers terrible hitbox. They're stalling, and I think Perfume went back for Mercenary. Down. Yep, they're healing. They're healing. They're healing. They're healing. She has to go back for Mercenary. Yep. Like, the thing is, she has to get aggressive here. She has to. I'm pretty sure Opera can pick up Merc here. She can pick up Merc and then go back for Gunner. That's a, that's a one escape. That's a one escape. Because Merc dies on chair, Gunner cannot heal in time. Unless she has like the max healing persona or something. Nah, with Opera's speed, there's no way. She can't self heal that in time. And even if she could, there's no there's nothing to open. The, the gate's not open. Yeah, that's a that's a that's a three K. That's a three K. So all of you that put the sixty four percent of you. That uh, that put 4K. It is not a 4K. It is that one escape. What did I say, dude? I I, I called it right in the middle of the match. It looked like a guaranteed one escape, and that's what they get. Because again, trade trade stop teleport is just so good, especially on Opera. But again, when you're fighting Opera, that's exactly what you want. That's it. You don't. You do not want to get 4K. If you can get one person out at least in an Opera match, you're good. You're good. 3K, 4K, same thing. It actually isn't. 3K versus 4K is not the same thing uh, when it comes to tournament settings. Because it, it, you can, it can come down to points. It can come down to points. That's the thing. If if a team, if it, let's say the next uh, opera series gets a 4K, um, and in in uh, round one second half, if the if the other um, stuff might offer all, I've literally only played opera in a custom, and that was like four months ago, and it was for like ten minutes. Otherwise, I've never played opera singer. Um, what was I saying? But yeah, if the next opera singer gets a 4K, that'll put um. It'll put Team WL in the lead. Because the points do matter. The points 100% do matter. Mm. Without a doubt. I don't know why I didn't end the poll earlier. <laughs> Am I still a A badge? No, I'm still I'm an S badge. What are you talking about? S badge. S1. Yeah, so the, the ciphers were pretty sped up, but they, they kind of... Um, I, I feel I, I don't know where they went wrong though. I think the thing where they went wrong was when um, the opera singer predicted patient vault and uh, got that terror shock. Because the first kite matters so much against opera. It matters so much. So 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 much. You watched Zeus play operas earlier, dude. I honestly I've seen Zeus's opera. It's not good. Sorry if you're watching the vod of this Zeus. I'm pretty sure he's asleep right now, but your opera is not good. <laughs> Oh boy. I mean, my opera's probably worse. Don't even, don't get me wrong. But I saw him and he was like not doing. He was not schmoving, dude. He was not schmoving. Uh, thank you, Sunimiya, for the uh, donation. I appreciate it. You will make it to call one day. Trust. I don't know. I don't know. The thing is, like, these people have been playing for years, right? I've been playing for like half a year, a little over half a year now. <laughs> so, the the amount of experience people have on me is crazy. Yeah, half a year already. Kind of crazy to think about. Anyways, uh, I believe they do they do the second game pretty short after, but for the second um, set, they usually take like a break. So we're, we're not going to switch off just yet. But I am going to mute them and play my own music for now. Actually, I don't want to listen to this music. <laughs> 
Let's uh, let's play this. Let's see. This is this a good theme? Uh, eh. It's fine for now. It's fine for now. Been playing for four years. Yeah, a lot of people have been playing for a long time, but um, no, I, I played when Tree Leader joined. That's when I started. What is that, Melody? This is the Pokemon World Poke World Pokemon World Tournament Finals from Black and White too. That's the song. Am I gonna do another Pokemon stream anytime soon? Probably, probably, probably not until um, probably not until like Monday or Tuesday or something. Yeah, so I don't know. I don't know when the next uh set is coming, but um, let me see here. So yeah, for those who don't know why Gardner is good against Opera Singer, it's specifically the bubble, um, because obviously the bubble she gets it for the fi first 50 seconds of the game. Which is basically like an extra HP, but it comes back whenever it goes away, and it takes like it's a 40 second um, thing to come back. So whenever she rebounds, if she can get behind a pallet and get the bubble off, it can be really freaking good. Um, and there there are some situations where you can kind of force yourself to get the bubble off and then get like a free transition, kind of like kind of like what the gardener did there at the very ending when uh, Opera trade stop teleported to her. She set up the bubble so she had like a pretty much free transition. Um, and then of course, obviously the veteran speed boost. Um, the additional two second boost when hit is so good because it's speed, it's distance. And if you get distance on opera, that's so good. It's obvious because she's staying still when you're getting hit and then you are getting all that speed. So it's just, it's so very good. Um, I don't really know that. Don't, that this, this, uh, this doesn't really matter. Uh, but it's, it's specifically these two abilities is why she is just so good. And especially since like she doesn't really work super well against any other hunter. Um, so she she comes out. She's like the perfect round one character. She she's like the perfect. You might be thinking like, oh, then why is that not the case for like other um, characters like Doc? Well, Doc has to stand still to get heals. And you might be like, oh, just just drop a pallet, heal behind it. But she can't heal that fast. The thing is, or Gardener, um, she can get the bubble up and tank a free hit. Uh, Doc has to stand still for like I think a maximum of six seconds to get it. Whereas Gardener is like it's like, like what three seconds for bubble. It's much faster, and then when you have the bubble, you can move with it. Whereas Doc will just immediately take another hit and then have to move somewhere else. Uh, so she does get the, the speed bonus, but it's just not nearly as good. Uh, Lawyer's broken. Lawyer's obviously is broken. Like, this character is insanely busted. Um, like, there, there's no reason for this character to be as broken as he is. He literally has, like, six abilities. <laughs> I don't know why they have... I don't know why they gave Lawyer so many abilities, bro. He has maps, so he can transition. He has... Vaulting buff, speed buff, decoding buff. Um, he can't get terror shocked, and he has veteran speed bonus. He literally has six abilities. That's so broken, dude. So busted. Anyways, um, enough of this. Let's 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 get back here into the next match. Yeah, character pick and start. Enchantress? No way. Against Opera Singer? There's no way they're picking. There's no way. And then Psych. Psych? Real? This is so weird. There's no way, right? There's no way they're playing Patty into an Opera Singer. She's garbage against Opera She dies instantly. I don't understand what the plan here is. Unless they have like some secret strategy, I don't know what they do. Because on paper, Enchantress gets completely bodied by Opera Singer. Because Opera approaches her, she gets one hit, she gets one free stun. Oh, they didn't ban, they didn't ban pri Priestess. Hold on. They didn't, they didn't ban Priestess. That's weird. So, um, the hunter is banning lawyer barmaid. Barmaid? Against opera? Really? Okay, I can see lawyer, because law like I just said, lawyer's busted. But lawyer, barmaid, officer. Yep, that makes sense. Officer. Um, aeroplane is, I can totally understand. Aeroplane is broken. And then for forward? I don't know. Forward's not that good against opera. Like, his harassment is annoying, but like, if you chase him, you can just kill him. Are they anticipating Hermit? I mean, is Patty good against Hermit? I don't know. Because you have to be so close to use your stuns, but the thing is with a Hermit, you need to constantly get distance. There's no way it's a round one Hermit, right? No way. And even then, if that is the case, like, Patty heals slowly, and you need to heal against a Hermit. And so does Psychologist if you use her whistle. I mean, Priestess has the Omni healing buff, so that kind of evens it out a little bit, but like, still... 
I don't know why they just wouldn't play opera. So they have to play opera here, but why Patty? I don't understand. Mm. Doctor against Hermit? I guess. It has to be opera. There's no way, right? Like, this is the only option. It is! It is round one Hermit! It's not, it's not opera! There's no way it's a round one Hermit. That's crazy. But, like, what does Patty do against this character? You guys called it! That's crazy! Alright, hold on. Let's, let's get another poll here. Let's get another poll. Can Alva get the 4K? Well, will we see 4K from the Alva? I don't know. I mean, I feel I feel like Priestess is pretty bad against Alva because if she goes to try and set up, <laughs> yo, lots of people putting no rip. I feel like actually it's pretty 50-50. Hold on. All right, similar spawn. Similar. Oh, officer, where are we going, bro? Yeah, see, set, putting Priestess in mill is so good because you can set up really good portals in the church. Um, you probably just chase the Priestess first, though. I feel like. And people are doubters. Is it? Oh yeah, it could be the the cat Alva from the Halloween. We might see cat Alva. I don't know, dude. I don't. I don't know what this team really does against a hermit. Because again, Patty can't gain distance against hermit because she stuns. She does her little baby stun, and then Alva's like, "Huh? You think that's cool? <laughs> Three second stun." <laughs> And then Psyche obviously has no kiting abilities, but she has a little bit of stress. Like, Priestess is going to be so necessary with that Omni heal buff. And Officer is going to be really nice because um he can waste the time. He has a long chair time. So the Officer Priestess is really nice, but I, I just don't know about Psyche and Chantress. I don't know. Alright, there, there's a slight... There's a slight um, People are not people are not expecting the, the 4K from Alva. It's so, I just don't understand why Enchantress, like round one, and they were confident in the Alva. Like they, I guess maybe this hunter just doesn't have an opera. I don't know, dude. We're just gonna have to see. Patty can farm stuns from shared damage. I mean that's true, but if she's first chase, she just dies. And even then, the stuns aren't that good because, again, you need to get distance on Alva, but he just stuns you. And it doesn't matter because he'll just hit you, right? Like, on paper, I feel like it's a horrible matchup for Patty. Alright, he took a second to... He really thought about what ciphers he wanted to connect there. Most Alvas I see them just kind of do it instantly. Alright, Priestess did not drop the pallet and set up the portals. That's actually good because he probably knew he was coming for her first. Does indeed have insolence detention. Pretty standard setup for Alva here. Um, flywheel, flywheel. F actually, everybody has flywheel. Everybody has borrowed time. Everybody has flywheel except for Officer who has tied. Oh, yep, and there's the Enchantress. Alright, I really want to see this matchup because literally, once he gets insolence, what, do, what does she do? What is she supposed to do? Boop. Okay. We have a color now. We have a color. And then stun. And then what does she do? He's waiting. I mean, it's going to be a long match because um, thing is we got a priestess. Hit through window. Boop. There's, fir there's first hit. Yep. There's first hit. She has two stuns. Two stuns. Break that pallet. That is slow pallet break. Yep. What? You're leaving the enchantress. Interesting. Oh. Chasing the priestess now, I see. Okay, well, yeah, he has, he has spirit bomb here. We're going to see spirit bomb. Ooh, good portal, good portal. Very good portal. I feel like chasing the enchantress is better, though. I mean, maybe? Yo, the portals are set up. Okay, but that's all her portals. That's all the portals. She drops the pallet to gain distance. And he doesn't break it. I actually would just break that pallet. That pallet is so annoying. Yeah, he's not going to have to break it. Yeah, that's such an annoying pallet. Very, very, very annoying pallet here. Um, he's a bot. He missed the stun. And she can make it to that pallet because he's slow. Ooh, that little... Did, did you see? That was actually really good. That smallest amount of movement. Bro. Stun. There's the hit. Okay. Spread damage good. And Chantus does have a three stack. Why teleport? I mean, Alva usually brings teleport, I feel. I mean, I guess he has spirit bomb that he could just use as his uh, makeshift teleport. Um, 
Ooh, good play, good play. He's I can't even lie, he's getting memed on. I can't even lie, he's actually getting memed on. He's actually getting memed on. I mean the thing is with Alva, you have plenty of time for Good flywheel. Are we gonna see a three stun here? Nope, little baby stun. Okay. But if he just stuns her here, which he will be able to now stun. Boop! Now she can't use her three stun. Boom, hit. And then like what when is she gonna get an opportunity to use that three stun if he just keeps stunning her first? I just don't know. And we're gonna switch back. What, the ciphers are looking pretty good. He needs to get something on a chair. Misses the stun. Or no, did he get that? I actually think he hit that stun. Never mind. It's Jover for Albert. He's kind of doing really badly. I can't even lie. I feel like he just needs to stay on a target. He keeps switching. Stun. Boop. Downs the priestess. Okay. They do heal the enchantress. Um. Wait, was that a regular heal? I actually don't know. I think that, yeah, that was a regular heal. That wasn't a psych heal. Okay, well, there's the first uh, chair. He most likely has control freak, so the chair time is going to go by pretty fast. Uh, and they are losing their support character, the priestess here. But the ciphers, we're going to see him switch it up a little bit. Maybe? Yep, switching it up, switching it up. Good. And officer is going to come on in here. Yep. Makes sense, makes sense. Buying some time. You don't have all the time in the world, though, Alva. And he's here. He's here. He's here early. He's here early. I would just hit. Yeah, if I'm him, I just hit. So I force him to rescue. Tide Turner is procced. Didn't waste a watch, which is which is both good and bad because he's gonna have that for later. But it also makes his decoding slower. So if he used the watch there, his decoding would be seven percent faster. Oh, I don't feel like that was necessary. Ooh, dude, he, he's he's like so he's just like so slightly no Alpha spirit bomb, good spirit bomb, good spirit bomb, good aim, boop gets the hit, shared damage though, shared damage, but the ciphers are looking so good. They are they're about to pop two ciphers, almost three ciphers. Yeah, no, he's he's not winning this. He's not winning this. I I genuinely think this is three escape. Well, I can't say that. I can't say that. This is actually more looking like a tie. Uh, maybe. I mean, if they play, if they do like some sort of support, they don't really have any good supporting characters though, except for that enchantress. Actually, the enchantress is, is she coming in? <gasps> I think the enchantress is coming in. No way. Patty Gaming. Does she just three stack here and get the rescue? Okay, she's taking her sweet time coming in. I don't actually know. I think it's, I'm pretty sure it's a tie. I'm pretty sure this is just a tie. They actually have two people coming in. Uh, stun. He's keeping his distance. Oh, he kept his distance from Patty. Yep. Three stun? Three stun? Three stun? Three stun. Yup, yup, there it is. There it is. And if, she, and if she takes another hit, she gets another three stun. Ooh, that was almost really good. Oh, rip. It's it's so Jover, bro. It's so Jover. The, dude, the ciphers are... Look at that. They have so many ciphers already. Patty is still here to potentially support. She's just grinding stuns right now. That was... Yeah. This is, this is literally potentially a three escape. I don't know why he just didn't play Opera. At least with Opera, you pretty much guarantee a tie. Like, are you really this confident in your Hermit? <laughs> nah, it's a three escape. It's a three escape, dude. It's a three escape. It could honestly even be a four escape if Patty gets a good three stun again. It's almost charged up. And they have damage sharing. Nope, that's, that's not enough, though. Wait, two are down. Okay, hold on. Wait, she cancels the tower recovery. Patty, you're a bot. No, she's throwing! She's throwing! She's throwing! She's throwing! If he teleports to the right gate, he knows. Teleport to the gate. Teleport. Okay, he's, not, he's gonna get the kill. All right, so that's one escape. Dude, she threw. She threw. She threw. She threw. She threw. She threw. All she had to do was just run away. I think she she literally just threw. She literally just threw. Do they do they, does he three K it? No way. There's no way he knows the officer is and kills him, right? There's no way. He's heading his way. No way. Nope, they're Okay. Kind of useless. There's no way he three Ks this. There's no way. He has tinnitus though. He has tinnitus. He didn't recognize. Does he not know he has tinnitus? Hello? Oh, he's playing it safe. No, that's it. That's it. That's a tie. Because now, by the time he gets back, even if he spirit bombs, officer just makes it out with Tide. 
No, he's, he's taking his tie. He's taking his tie. He doesn't want backdoor. He's taking his tie. Oh, you could have pushed, bro. You could have pushed. You could have capitalized off that endgame mistake. Yeah, he's just taking the tie. Oh, I get it. I get it. I get it. Dang. That enchant just kind of threw. I can't even lie. She kind of threw. That, the way she cancelled the attack recovery, bro. Man, the one time we see Enchair just in tournament and she throws. <laughs> Poor Patty. Oh, boy. Well, he got a tie, guys. How about that? What was that about survivors being able to make more mistakes? Okay, that's not... The, okay, that's detention, though. That's detention. You can't say that when that's detention. Obviously, survivors can make far more mistakes than hunters. But when it's detention, it's it's that's when that's when things are more hunter favorite because obviously he just has boosted damage. But early early game, if a hunter misses a blink, like just uh, just say GG, just shake their hand and say GG at that point. <laughs> I can't believe dude, that. I can't believe the one time we see Patty and she cancels attack recovery. <laughs> oh boy. Oh boy. Well, it looks like um, it looks like um, Axis has the lead then, because they, they got a 3k versus a tie. I'm pretty sure. Interesting. All right, I'm and I'm pretty sure. I'm pretty sure that. Oh, I don't know why I paused. I'm pretty sure that's it for now, um, because we have to wait for the second set. So, at this point. We, we go back to our- we go back to memeing now. We go back to memeing until they start the second set. So what, what do we want to see now? That's the big question. <laughs> what do we want to see now? What's, what's our meme pick now? Are we getting no golden apple event in game? I don't know. I actually have no idea. We might when it comes to NAE. I'm not sure. Shout out to round one hermit, my favorite tie hunter. Indeed, thank you, Alpha Fan One, for the, uh, um, for the donation. I appreciate it. Oh, it has to be a hunter that I have. I'm sorry. I ha it has to be a hunter that I have. Um, so I'm sorry to say that I don't have all the hunters yet. But it, ha it has to be one of the hunters I have. So I don't have I don't have Percy, Wax, Wheel, Hermit, Opera. Dream Witch, Chad Eyes, Wu Chang, Soul Weaver, Geisha. I actually am lacking a lot of hunters. <laughs> Nightmare, Patroller, Ripper, Fish Lady, Mr. Feast. I'm seeing a lot of I'm seeing a lot of rippers. You guys want to see my S1 Ripper, I guess. Let me let me show these pro players how it's done with my <laughs> split trump card jack. Let me show these pro player. Let me show these pro players how it's done. <laughs> let me see. Let me let me show them how it's done. We'll start. We'll start off with peepers, then we'll swap to patroller, most likely. <laughs> oh boy. Oh boy, dude, that's so funny. And if the, if the set starts early, the thing is, I'm playing hunter, so I can just surrender whenever I want. Well, as long as it's like somewhat into the game, I can let you surrender. It doesn't matter. That's why I'm not playing survivor, because if I play survivor, then I'll have to. Uh, I'll be throwing for my team, but if it's if it's Hunter, then it's, it's only me who's throwing, so it doesn't matter. All right, here we go. Yeah, if there's ha if there's hackers, like there's nothing I can do, honestly. Like that's that's just gonna be unfortunate. So we do find our first target here. Um, actually, I think we found two people. Uh, hold on, they're hiding. Ooh, they just they almost got hit by that, but you know, that should have hit. Dare I say they might be hacking, honestly. <laughs> okay, hold up. He actually has the accessory, but he's running Kokichi skin. He's gonna drop the pallet because he's scared. He's so scared. He knows, he knows. He's like, oh my gosh, that's the, is that the S1 Ripper, dude? So scary. Oh, he's hacking, he's hacking. He's definitely hacking. I mean, that's definitely hacks. That 100% should have hit. All right, he's gonna, he's gonna drop pallet. Oh, beautiful, beautiful. All right, cool. The insolence is coming in, bro. The insolence, the insolence. He, he doesn't expect it. He doesn't expect it. All right. Pepper. Break that pallet. Beautiful. All right. Now we just snipe with the foggy blade. The most broken ability in the game. 
He thinks he's so like look at look at how far away he is. He thinks he's so safe right now. He thinks he's so safe. But literally he's not gonna see this coming. Bruh, how did that not hit him? <laughs> he's hacking. We go around it, we go around it, we go around it, and You think I knew you were gonna use flywheel. Bruh, he's hacking. I think he's hacking. You know, I should I should report him to the to the official netties. Um I should maybe report him to official netties because like I don't know how he's kiting my S1 Ripper. Like, do, why do they put the embalm coffin on him? Like, bruh. Okay, so he's literally hacking. He's literally hacking. What am I supposed to do against this? Like that that foggy hits every time, but he's hacking. I don't understand, bro. Oh, let me let me drop a pepper here. He's hacking. There we go. Okay, does, do they just use the coffin though? They probably just use coffin, right? Because they're so scared of my S1 Ripper. Switch to patroller. You might be right here. You might be right. We might need to see Jerry come out. It might be time for Jerry. He's actually opting not to use the coffin. Big mistake. Big mistake. Should have used Jerry when you had the chance. Or, I'm sorry. Not Jerry. I have Jerry. Should have used the coffin. Because all I have to do is just foggy them. The most broken ability in the game. Oh, here we go. Speaking of... Hey, bud. Get the rescue, get the rescue. Mm. Okay, I'll just put you in chair and then go after Acrobat. Come here. Cause now I, I have sights on Acro. Beautiful, there we go. And now I chase you. Where is he going? Don't even try to go in, don't even try to go in church, bro. I got Foggy. Bro, he's hacking! He's hacking! Is that firebomb ugly? I can't use Jerry. I still make this. Yeah. Bro, he hacked. I can't believe it. I can't believe these hackers would just do this right in front of my face, right in front of my S1 Hydra freaking Jack. How dare they, dude? Why is he hacking? I don't know. I, they, they, just, they just don't think, I just don't think they can beat my, uh, my Ripper any other way. Oh, beautiful. <laughs> this is funny. This is funny, this is funny. Hey, buddy. How are we feeling? <laughs> oh, that's funny. All right. Three, two. Oh, never mind. He's hacking. Bro. Why do you have to hack all the time? I don't understand. Don't make me use Jerry. He has no more bombs, I don't think. Bro, I don't understand. I don't understand why everybody has to hack against my Ripper. And Doc's coming into body block. They're both coming into body block? That's crazy. That's crazy. That's crazy. Um, get hit by this. Hackers, bro. What am I supposed to do? There's just honestly not much I can do against the hackers, dude. There really isn't much. Just gonna walk through. Okay. Fine. Be that way. <laughs> oh, boy. So the cypher's primed. Pop? Bro. They're literally, like, ganging up on me. With hacks. Like, if there's no other way to beat the S1 Ripper, I get it, bro. That should hit. Pop. It'd be funny. Pop? We're not popping. We're throwing. We're throwing! We're throwing! Bro, why are we throwing? You guys are using hacks and you're throwing. I don't understand. I don't understand why they're throwing, bro. Like, they used all the hacks in the world to try and beat me, and they're still throwing. Another coffin. Oh yeah, he can use coffin for himself now, can't he? Huh. It's pretty crazy if you ask me. All right, here we go. Foggy Blade. Jerry, go! Dang, it takes a long time for Jerry to do his thing. <laughs> oh, there you are. She's gonna vault that, she's gonna vault that. Yup, predictable, predictable, predictable. Jerry. Oh, let's go. Wait, they have a coffin set up. What if I just don't use it? What if I, what if I just don't pick her up, huh? What then? <laughs> I know you guys are hiding on the other side of the map, using your hack bomber and your hack firmer, hack robot, and hacker. <laughs> what is Doctor coming in for? Oh boy. What are we doing, guys? What are we doing? Well, I get the heck out of here, hackers. Hackers. Doc, ugly. 
There we go. All right, now I just have to teleport back to the other gate, and then there's nothing that they can do. Surely. <laughs> oh, where's dungeon, bro? Where's dungeon? Where's dungeon? All right, she's either at the gate or she's at dungeon. Let, let's hope the hack hacker is at the, the gate. Oh? I thought I had, I swear I had tinnitus for like two seconds. Oh, there you are. What are you doing over there? Oh, I think she can beat me to the gate. I'm pretty sure she beats me to the gate. <laughs> oh, she 100% beats me there, bro. Nah, my, my Jack's got this, my Jack. <laughs> Jerry! Jerry, save us all! Jerry! <laughs> bro, that Hackrobat, dude, he was just hacking too hard. What was I supposed to do, bro? The Hackrobat was too good. Oh, this is perfect timing. They're choosing characters. They're choosing characters. Anyway, that, that was a really good 4K from me, honestly. That was a really good 4K from me. Beautiful, beautiful 4K from the S1 Ripper. Anyways, here we go. We're seeing anti. Wait, what the heck? Anti. Anti Seer? First picks? Okay, they're fine with Antiquarian and Seer both being banned for the rest of the round. That's crazy. Yeah, as you can see, Gardner and um, Perfumer are already banned. So, Hunter bans Priestess, Mercenary, Aeroplanist, pretty standard bans. And we're seeing... They ban Dream Witch, actually. They're not even banning Opera Singer. The survivors are allowing them to go Opera. Interesting. They only ban... Um, Yo, Seer's crazy. Yo, Seer, bro, he's dying. Help him! <laughs> I don't know why they didn't ban Opera. That's crazy. Imagine a Geisha? Uh, This is Ever Sleeping Town, right? We could see Geisha. Coordinator, okay. We could honestly just see Opera. We might just see Opera again. Banning Embalmer, huh. Alright. I'm, I'm curious, honestly. I'm kind of curious. Close the poll? Oh, yeah, thank you. I don't know why I didn't close that. I, f I forget. Alright, here we go. Alva didn't get the 4K. I don't know why I still have that poll up, and I should close that. Thank you for reminding me. I don't do polls often. <laughs> Right, I will start another poll, but it depends on who the hunter is. It's so weird to me that they picked Seer and Antiquarian first. Like, Antiquarian is so broken. BQ, maybe? I feel like it's just Opera. It's Opera, yeah, because they're not... It's Opera again, yeah, it's Opera. Opera 4K? <laughs> I mean, Anti against Opera is like... She's she's not bad, but I don't know. I just don't know. Should have let them play Dream Witch. She's fun to watch. Yeah, yeah. I don't know why they didn't ban Opera. I guess they're just confident against, confident against Opera now. And I don't I don't think I've seen a uh, Rise or Riz or whatever you pronounce their name as. I don't think I've seen them play. Um, I don't think I've seen them play anything else before. Huh. Maybe maybe they maybe they have a Dream Witch. I don't know. Officer spot middle, smart. The thing is, they have, they have two characters with long chair times as well. Coiner with a 10% bonus, to, uh, Officer with a 20% bonus initially. Looks like they want Core to take the chase. Yeah, I mean, Core, Core is good against Opera, because most Operas don't bring excitement. Like, why, why would you bring excitement as an Opera singer? There's no reason to. Ready to see Ivy? Ivy will not be legal. Ivy, Ivy won't be, uh... She won't be playing in tournaments till the summer, most likely. She'll just be too new. Same with Puppeteer. Both those, both those characters won't be available until the summer tournaments, probably. For now, though, we've got Opera ru uh, ruling over the meta. <laughs> I'm Korean and we don't have a lot of IDV content. YouTubers, you're my favorite channel. I watched all your top videos in a few days. Love the content. Thank you. Thank you, Imunis. I appreciate that. I don't know if I said your name correctly, but I appreciate that. That's very kind. I'm surprised that there's not a lot of Korean content creators, though. That's interesting. <laughs> Get Opera out of here. Well, she's not out of here yet. It's so weird to me. Like, they, they, this team, like, it feels like this team is like, yeah, let's, let's, 
let's ban Dream Witch and let's keep letting them play opera. And let's not play opera ourselves. All right, well, here we go. It's time. Opera singer speed, here she goes. Gonna be chasing, wait, is that Kyoko coordinator? I'm pretty sure that's Kyoko Kirigiri. Danganronpa crossover, I think it is. Yep, it is. Yo, Kyoko, woo. One of the best coordinator skins for sure. Oh, good, good, good. Oh my, jeez, that was close. Without Cord's fast vaulting, though, that was probably Terra Shock. That was that was a mix of Cord fast vaulting, and we're gonna see gun. Oh, base the gun. There's the gun. beautiful, beautiful, beautiful gun, beautiful gun, beautiful gun from the corner. Honestly, not that much distance though. Not even that much distance. And we do. That was excitement. She has excitement. See, that's that's why you see early gun from corner. If you're wondering why, if you're wondering why the card used the gun so early, this series they just don't want somebody dying. They don't want somebody dying. That's so good. The support is here, dude. I mean, they both they've used up both their like really really important critical items. Good, good, good reaction time from the uh, coordinator. Drop pallet. Go behind. Drop pallet. Beautiful. Okay. This is this is a good kite. This is a really good kite so far. Break pallet. Okay. Transition now. Transition. The thing is, she already used up the pallet here, so she's gonna have to take a hit. Don't vault that. Oh my gosh. Don't vault that. Whoo. All right, Cornier is gonna die here. She's she's dead. She's dead. There's not. She's gonna die. It's, it's, she has to mind game this pal here. She has to mind game this pal, and she failed the mind game. Yup, that's it. Yup, there's death. There's nowhere else to go. There's nowhere else to go. She used up everything. There's not. The thing is, after you use up those center pallets um, in the mid area of ever sleeping, there's not many other safe areas to go to. Um, she used up like all the good pallets. That was a good kite though. That was almost a three cipher kite. And the excitement is still up now. The thing is, she only has excitement for the antiquarian. That, that's why we saw the coordinator use it so early. With Opera, you want to spam items? Kinda. Kinda. That's why you see everybody using up their items. Like, the only one who still has, like, a uh, max item is Antiquarian. And even then, she could just... They don't they don't know what her trait is. Um, they probably know it's either... They probably think it's Teleport or Excitement. Because the thing is, she didn't use Blink during the chase. And she didn't use Abnormal. So they know it's either Excitement or Teleport. So the Antiquarian, when she uses it, she might actually just go for one flick uh, of the stun, and then just and then just uh, waste the excitement, and then save the rest of her flute. Like, most top players will most likely do that because um, she's not swapping to anything. So we are going to see uh, Corner dies all the way in uh, graveyard, but um, the ciphers are looking pretty good. This is looking this is looking like a tied position so far. Uh, no other tied besides first option. Though. Actually, there's they're actually opting to run more kiting focus builds instead of uh, tied focus builds, which is really interesting. I'm not really sure why. I guess they were confident in having like the double stunner and like the single rescue, but now I feel like they just they could honestly sell this if they really wanted to. Um, cause the corner has zero rebound potential. She's, she's chatting on a terrible chair. Um, I guess they can rescue now that she's getting aggressive. Actually, Antiquarian can get the, I don't know why Antiquarian's not rescuing. Oh, never mind. She teleported back. I'm stupid. I was looking in the bottom left. <laughs> it's, it is looking like a tie right now though. It is looking like a tie. Anti's waiting. Watch has been used. Yeah. So the thing is, the bad thing is they have no more items basically. They have Antiquarian's foot and that's it. They have no more items. Uh, Antiquarian actually does get the rescue. Wait, she's throwing. The opera's throwing. She has to go back. Yeah, go back, go back, go back, go back. Go back. Yep. She got to trans. Now the thing is, she hasn't used traits, so she's gonna have excitement. But even then, if she uses excitement now, she's not gonna have a trait for endgame. Stun. No excitement used. She's just holding onto it, so they so they don't know what trait she has. Dude, the excitement's so useless. Why are we playing opera with excitement? There's no reason to. Even if you get gunned, like, you saw how much distance coordinator got from that, like, zip. You're so fast, you don't need excitement. And she's not even using it, because she's getting, oh my gosh, she's throwing. Why do we bring uh, excitement on an opera singer? She used it for a palace! She's throwing. She's throwing. She's throwing. You're playing the best hunter in the game and you bring excitement. Why do you bring excitement? Mm. Excitement is a defensive trait, it's not an offensive trait. Oh boy. Why? I don't understand. Four escape? There's a chance. It's not a high chance, but there's a chance. I mean, I guess an opera singer, realistically, it's not going to be that she does have the tension. Wait, 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 the coordinator. Hold on, she found the coordinator again. And coordinator is dead on chair. Um, gets the knee jerk effect speed. Beautiful. Look at that. So much speed, dude. But Opera can catch up so fast. We got antiquarian support. 
Stun? Excitement is not up though, because it used on a freaking pallet stun. Oh my gosh. She just, she's literally just, she's keeping them off the cypher now at this point. I mean, they have to set up a new cypher. They have to set up a new cypher. Hold on. Wait, wait, this is looking good. As long, oh. No, chair the officer. Chair the officer, chair the officer. They can heal, it's fine. It doesn't matter if they heal, you have to keep them off this cypher. You can't let them pop that cypher. They have to set up a new one. Honestly, if I'm this opera singer, I swap to, I swap to abnormal. I'm not even joking. I, I might, this might, might be a stupid play, but I generally just swap to abnormal if I'm this opera singer. Yeah, guarding the cypher, guarding the cypher. Coordinator's pull, pulling up an item. Anti is here. Just gonna get a hit on Anti. Good flywheel, good flywheel. Just gonna take the hit, yep, gonna take the hit, gonna take the hit. Force the rescue, force the rescue. We got pallet, just hit anti, just hit anti. Yep, down goes anti. The oh, but another cypher's pot, yeah, okay. So that maybe maybe a normal play is not good because they're starting up the new cypher. Oh, she's trying to she's trying to prevent the cypher pop. She's trying to. She needs to make this seer vault. Seer vault so she teleports back. Teleport back? Or just dash back, okay, that's fine. Dude, they're starting up all of the last cyphers. All right, go for anti. No, not even go for anti. Oh my gosh, you need to start sharing people. You need to start sharing. Oh, good, good. That was actually really good. That was so good. Okay, you can share officer. I mean, the thing. Oh my gosh. Ah, this is actually kind of intense. What the heck? I thought she was throwing, but like. Why are we sharing in basement? Why are we sharing? Why are we sharing in basement? You can't pressure the ciphers in basement. No, you're throwing. What are you doing? Now they just, honestly, they just pop. They just pop and go. <laughs> no, they're coming, they're coming. That's risky setting in the coordinator. That's really risky. Those, these two are both dead on chair. Boop, pop, rescue, and then kill. They don't have, okay. You'll kill coordinator, that's a tie, that's a tie. That's a tie. I, yeah, that's a tie. She just she just kills officer and then they're both dead on chair. Um, dead. Does she trade stop teleport though? Does she get aggressive? This. No, nope, she's not gonna. She's taking her tie. Really? I don't know why she brought excitement. Why do you bring excitement? I mean, I guess you are. I guess they are in the lead, so it doesn't matter. But like, dang, dude. I don't know why you ever bring. <laughs> <laughs> she knew the exact timing. Oh, that's funny. I... I don't understand why she brought excitement. There was zero reason to bring excitement. Like, the coordinator gun? You saw how much distance that coordinator gun got? Nothing. And she brought excitement for that. For what? For what? Like, don't bring... It. If you play opera singer, never bring excitement. Just don't do it. Never, never bring excitement as opera. There's zero reason to. Excitement, it, I, I've, I've been told that like, uh, mainly from Zeus, that excitement is just a draw trait. It secures ties, and what, what did she get? A tie. And she only used her trait one time for a pallet stun. <laughs> oh, she only used it for a pallet stun, dude. What is that? What actually is, I mean, yeah, there's an antiquated in the match, but like, you're opera singer, who cares? It doesn't matter. You're opera singer. I don't understand. I just don't understand. I mean, it was a good kite from the start. I can't even lie. The, the, the first kite was good. It was a three cypher kite with gun plus owl. That was solid. That was actually just straight up solid. But... I mean, I'm a mid-level player, so maybe these top players know things I don't. But I don't know why we bring excitement on a, a top a top hunter like opera singer. And like chairing cherry in the basement, I don't really know why. I guess the reason she chaired the basement was she she probably just gave up. Um, she gave up the fact that she she knew that like I can't pressure these ciphers any longer like oh, two more other ciphers are being worked on um she's probably just like yeah I think I can only tie this if I go into basement I can pretty much secure the draw because basement is so powerful so I think I think that's the reason why she chaired a basement because she was like yeah let me just secure this draw like I'm clearly not gonna get um I'm clearly not not gonna get better than a better than a tie so she just basins it to secure it. So I guess I understand the basin play. Now I look uh, back into the match. 
But it's still just so weird to me. Bringing excitement. It, she was literally, she literally just played without a trait, basically. And she used it on a pallet stun. Like, bruh. I just don't understand. Japanese team enthusiast here. Rise has been known for being really unstable with his plays, but good for when he's good. I see. Okay. I mean, I'm, I'm not, I'm not saying like these top players are bad or anything. I'm just, I'm more just like, why are we? Oh, I should end the freaking poll now. Um, I'm, I'm just really uh, wondering why she brought excitement. And like, I know they have coaches on the team too. Like, you think their coach should be like, don't? Why are we bringing excitement on an opera singer? I don't know. Like, you, you bring you on opera singing, you bring teleport, blink, or abnormal. Well, yeah, I, honestly, where's the listen smiley? Just bring out the listen smiley at this point. Honestly, just bring out the listen smiley. Shouldn't I be asleep? Yes. <laughs> it's funny that you asked. Shouldn't you be asleep? Have you read the title of the stream? <laughs> <laughs> I should be asleep, but... Oh, boy. I don't... I, I still don't understand why, why you're bringing excitement there. Feeling a little silly, goofy. I just... I don't understand. Why do you bring excitement as opera singer? You're so powerful. Like... Who, 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 bring, who brings excitement? Like, I mean, any, I guess any draw hunter. Nyad, Nyad could bring it. Bloody Queen could bring it. Nightwatch shouldn't bring it, but he can bring it. Bonbon, <laughs> um, Bonbon bon bon with excitement is pretty common. Especially if there's like a good stun, like a coordinator. Because the thing is, like, there, there are some harasses that counter Bonbon, like coordinator, cowboy. And having excitement for stuff like that would be really good. Because Bonbon, you just want to secure the draws and get those camps. Like, the, when Bonbon comes out in tournament, it means they want a tie. Like, they need it. Honestly, the, the, the hunter that I want to see the most in the in this tournament is uh is lizard i want to see lucino i want to see him do something bro that this new full presence ability like i want to see him cook i want to see him do something dude he literally can jump infinitely as long as he has energy i need to see it dude i want to see him cook <laughs> but, I don't know for sure. <laughs> Joseph. <laughs> Dude, the day we see Joseph at tournament is the day... Never mind, we're never seeing Joseph at tournament. He's literally, like, just too bad. Any, any good team, any good team can beat a Joseph. If you have good coordination, there's no reason you should ever lose to a Joseph. Uh, especially in a VC. There is zero reason you should ever lose to a Joseph. <laughs> Joseph Patroller. <laughs> I think insults Joseph is the way. <laughs> <laughs> All right, here we go. Second half of round two. Patty and Psych are globally banned. Will they play opera? Will they ban opera? Let's see. Who do they ban? Do they ban Dream? Opera? Hermit? Who will the survivors ban? Banning Priestess and Arrow. Okay, good, good, good. Survivor ban up next. Let's see. Please ban opera. Thank you. Ban opera. There we go. Whew. Very good. Very good. Very good. And first two characters now. Let's see. I'm actually curious who they're going to pick here. We got Ever Sleeping Town. Melly! Yes! Melly Gaming! Melly! Oh, I'm so ready for Melly. Yep. I'm rooting for T Team Axis now because they're playing Melly. Woo! All right. Third serve. Third serve. Let's see. We got Melly Gaming. The first Melly of Koa. Yes. I'm so ready. This is already looking like a hype team so far. Melly Anti is like super hype. Officer? Okay. 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 Safe pick. Safe pick. The stream is lagging. Oh, we're good. <laughs> is that my stream? Hold on, is that my stream or just the... 
Okay, no, I'm pretty sure. I'm pretty sure that's host. I'm pretty sure that's host. We're good. All right, last survivor. Let's see. Come on, get, be another hype character. Be another hype character. Come on. Come on. Give me, give me something that can like gain distance. I was literally about to say patient. Can I get a patient that can gain distance? All right, this is a, this is a solid team. This is a hype team. Melee, anti, officer, patient. This is a pretty hype team. Patient is going through it though. What is happening with him, bro? Whew. <laughs> Look at him. <laughs> Banning dancer again is interesting. I guess they don't want the dancer setting up a bunch of boxes in mid. We might see Dream Witch. We could see Dream Witch. A mom. I'm pretty sure this is a different hunter. We could see Dream Witch. Thing is, they need a win, so they I could see a Dream Witch. They're not gonna pick a draw hunter. They can't. They can't afford draws right now. They need a hunter with win potential right now. They need a hunter with win potential. So they're gonna. We're gonna see Dream Witch. We could see Night Watch. Um, Wax Artist. Wheel and maybe Geisha or Naya, but those are like draw. Uh, Geisha could get Geisha could have wins. Naya's more of a draw hunter. Who do we see? Please don't be wax. I don't want to watch a wax disciple. That's a tie hunter. You what? You need a win. Why are you picking disciple? I mean, Disciple does do good against this team. I feel, well, Patient kind of, I feel like Patient's pretty good against Disciple, but like, Antiquarian versus Disciple, I don't know. I don't know why they're picking Anne, though. And First off, I guess, I guess, you know, actually, wait, Anne counters First Officer. That's a weird spawn. Hmm. Okay. All right, let's see. Let's set up. Let's set up the poll. We got and 4K. <laughs> what what are we thinking, guys? I mean, the thing is, Anne Anne can be good against this team, but I feel like I don't know how good Anne is against Patient. I mean, again, my my Anne experience isn't that good, but I know she's good against Officer, so that might be the reason for this. I can't. Kite, I mean, I can't. I can't kite Anne at all. I can't kite Anne at all, dude. And she, she's most likely gonna chase Melly first. I don't like that. Uh, I don't know if I like that. Cause like, what? Well, you're not gonna chase a patient first, cause he can gain distance. I mean, Mel, Mel, here's the thing. Melly can be good against a low presence and against max presence and I don't think she can do anything. But I'm pretty sure I'm pretty sure Melly could cook at low presence. It just depends. She's most likely gonna have a solid 60 second kite against the end. Cause she's gonna take one hit and then die to blink. And that, and from there, it just it all depends on the the rescue and harassment. So, yeah, I don't know. It's really it's really gonna depend on this first kite, which I guess is the case for like a lot of games and especially for disciple. But this this first kite is gonna it's gonna be very important. Oh come on, Melly! Come on, Melly! I believe. I believe if if they at least get a draw, like they're they're, they're fine. Cause like disciples a draw hunter. If they get a draw, like, that's just to be expected. Come on, Melly. I believe in you. Come on, Tuna. <laughs> oh, boy. Ann sounds... Yeah, Ann sounds is so good. The thing I don't like about Ann is her ability. It feels so active. It Like, the cats are active. Like, they're, so, they're out for so long. That's what I hate about her so much. They're, so, they're out forever, dude. Yep, and she immediately sets up cats. Does a jump, all right. And like the, the curve of the jump is crazy, dude. So she's actually opting to go mid first. Hmm. Good early rotation. It's Quirin's camping up in the two-story area. She has sights, she has sights. Are we gonna see her chase the... The thing is, they're rotating. They probably want Patient to take the kite. That's why he's kind of out in the open. She has sights on Patient. No, that's Officer, never mind. Jump, jump, okay. Ceiling ability. She's literally just getting rotated right now. Uh oh. That's Kong Ho Melly! That's Kong Ho I know Kong Ho Melly when I see it. That's Kong Ho Melly. Come on, Melly. Ah, uh, Melly's gonna take first chase as I thought. Yup. Gonna go into graveyard. Wait, she has excitement. Why are we bringing excitement? What? Why are we bringing excitement? Alright, Melly, come on. Bees are sealed. Bees are sealed. Hey! She can't pull back her bees! No! Because they're sealed! That's cringe. Alright. Auntie just leaves. Yeah, no no support necessary. Come on, Melly. 
What is Melee's trait? What is Melee's trait? Uh, Melee has knee jerk. Okay. Go behind pallet. Drop pallet. Beautiful. Beautiful. Now she can't stun you. Now she can jump. She just jumps. Jump. Stun. And boop. All right. There's the first hit. But this is good. This is this is already good. I, again, I don't know why she only has excitement for an Antiquarian. I guess these hunters really hate Antiquarian. Um, jump is almost back up. We see cats. She dodges cats. Okay. Ooh, ooh. Maybe, almost some harassment. Mm. Oh, yes, bees it up. It completely ignores the bees. Set up the wax. Go. Zoom, zoom, zoom. Come on, Melly. Win. You got this. Cats. Guaranteed cats. She's dead. Oh, but the bees. She excitements the bees. Yo. The disrespect. Get those bees out of there, Melly. Come on. Yes. You're almost out of bees. Okay. Dude, she excitement in the bees. You're so lame. Yo, who excitements bees? Oh, that's disgusting. Melly's too powerful. They, she had to excite the bees just to get her down. That's a, she's just too strong, bro. Melly is too powerful. Uh, now it's just gonna be camping. And the thing is, uh, I mean, officers coming in. Two ciphers are done. Yep, here's officer. Here comes cross because freaking ants cats are super. Wait, double rescue, double rescue. Oh, oh, yes. Oh, rip. Uh, Melly. Oh no, come on, no, no. That wasn't tied. They're just gonna farm Melly now. She kills bees. Bees are gone. Melly has zero rebound kite potential. They're gonna sell. Wait, Auntie, please. Why didn't you stun? Oh, but the basement's done. Please. Auntie, you're throwing. You save her. What are you doing? You had like two opportunities. Oh. You know excitement's not up. You're a top player. You should know that. I'm gonna cry. They're throwing. They're letting Melly die. Now officer's just here to. He already has a hit. He's just here to feed tinnitus. I'm gonna cry, bro. I'm gonna cry. They're literally selling Melly. Oh my gosh, bro. I don't understand. Save her. Kago Melly. The first Melly that appears in the tournament, and she's the first one to die on the team. Hunters just hate Melly, dude. So sad. Should have chased the patient first. Alright. Can you, guys, at least get the draw for Melly? Get the draw, please. Get the draw for her. Yo, the cats can just freaking fly. They can just walk on air, I guess. Jeez, magical cats. And he's cornered, and he's going to take a hit. Interesting, I guess. Why did she wait so long? What? Why did she wait like three years before hitting? Hello? Patient, you have hooks? Thank you. He's using his hook. He messed it up! He's a bot! He messed up his hook! How do you mess that up? You jumps and you're dead. Bro, they're throwing. How do you mess that up? Is that my patient? Uh, she recalled, oh, it was his ability. I didn't even notice. <laughs> I mean, either way, like, what was that hook after that, though? Oh, boy. I mean, this is still a draw. This is still a draw. Officer, tied. She's trying to seal the antiquarian so they can't pop, but she missed, I'm pretty sure. Did she? No, the, oh, it's there. Oh, 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 I see. Pop, boom. Yep. She has excitement so she can, she can get anti down. Anti, you just camp, you literally just camp this. You literally just camp this. You're dead. Tram, 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 tram. Oh, tram to the rescue. Drop the pallet, please drop the pallet. Thank you. Thank you. Did she make it a time stunt? Nope. She, I think she's probably gonna try to fly with her, honestly. No gate has been open. Oh, she can trace up teleport. Oh dear. Now, if somebody stays in mid, yeah, somebody's staying in mid. Yeah, officer staying in mid. This should, this should be still a tie. Should be still a draw. Cause thing is, off. There's a trait. There's a teleport. Yep. And it's on patient though. Oh, careful. He can honestly just get on tram. Yep, he gets on tram. Waste time. Beautiful. Yep, tram there. At the yo. The, the, honestly, I can't even lie. The survivors are getting lucky. They're actually getting lucky. Oh, officer though. Hold on. But nobody's on the gate though. Nobody's on the gate though. She sees officer. Um. 
There's no way this is a 3k, right? How do they tie this, actually? I don't even know how they tie this. Um, jumps? She's just preventing the rescue, but like, how do they? No, he goes for he goes for gate, and then they they get out dungeon. But she's going back for officer. She's doing a really I can't even lie. She's doing a really good job of guarding both things. She's she's both guarding the chair and the door at the same time. That's so good. But officers on the gate. This should just be a tie because the 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 thing is there. And patient surely gets out. Patient, if you throw this, bro, I will hate you for all time. It's not going to be open. <gasps> oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. No. He crawls. 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 Oh my God. Oh. I swear, bro. I swear. You almost. <laughs> <sighs> I mean, honestly, she, no, she swapped the teleport. She already swapped the teleport. I'm stupid. I would say she could have trade swapped blade, but no, she already swapped the teleport. Bro. At least they got the draw. Rest in peace, Melly, but they got the draw. Against the draw hunter with excitement. <laughs> but just barely. Jeez. I feel like the anti should have just harassed though, right? Like, am I stupid? She didn't even use her stick like at all. What were you saving the stick for, huh? End game where you didn't use it at all? <laughs> oh boy. Yeah, end with a tie. What a shocker indeed. Oh boy. Well, two ties. Very cool. <laughs> oh boy. Oh boy, let me let me swap the music here. Oh boy, um, yeah, they need they still need a hunter with wind potential though, because that's just a draw. WL needs something that isn't a draw. They need a win. I don't know. Japan teams aren't as aggressive as China. They like to secure a tie a lot, but why are they trying to secure a tie when they're down? I don't understand. Is it just is it just more they they play, play for draws and then play off survivor mistakes? Is that what it is? I guess I understand that because at that point it's just whittling your team down, right? Because you play draw hunters, secure draws until somebody messes up, and then you get a 3k or something. But at that point, like you could also slip up with your draw hunter. I don't know. I guess I understand why they do it. Cause the thing is like for 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 hunters like Bonbon, bon, right? For Hunter's like Bonbon, bon, he's like a tie god, right? He guarantees ties, but he doesn't often get more than that, right? Like, he's made for ties. If you need to tie, you play Bonbon bon if you want to play it safe. But when it comes to, like, Disciple, uh, Nyad, Bloody Queen, Geisha, like, these are all characters that can get draws, but also can, like, capitalize off survivor mistakes and get wins as well, I feel like. Uh, same with Nightwatch. That's kind of where Nightwatch is now. Because uh, Nightwatch used to be a hunter with win potential, but now he's kind of like the the tie king where he get, he gets ties, and if there's survivor mistakes, then he can get a 3k, so. I guess maybe that's more of the sentiment, where they're just, like, not wanting to, like, over overplay. And I guess the thing about Dream Witch is she's such high maintenance. It takes so much brain power to play her, and it probably exhausts the players. Because I have to keep track of so much with Dream Witch. I, I, don't, I don't know how Dream Witch players do it, bro. I don't know how they do it. But they're, they're crazy with it. I do kind of hope we'll see some Dream Witch, though. They, 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 I feel like eventually, like, I would like to at least see them play Hunters with uh, win potential. Um, so we, we could see... Insolence can find Mary with Peepers. <sighs> Maybe. <laughs> Um, let's see. I'm seeing a lot of Marys again. Seeing a lot of Marys. Oh, I mean, I've already got the Insolence Confined set up. <laughs> the Peepers, though? Oh, boy. Here we go. We could, we could do Mr. Feast next. We could do Mr. Feast. I do kind of want to play Mr. Feast. Mr. Feast! Okay, yeah, they're they're just showing replays right now. I've got I've got the sights on my phone, so we're good. In case they set up, an, I still can't believe that freaking rise just just used the freaking excitement. 
<laughs> on that pallet stun, dude. So goofy. So freaking goofy. Gotta go, Alva One Fan out, or we'll be back soon. Don't have too much fun without me. Thank you for dropping by and for the donation. I appreciate it. And we did we did get to see an Alva match, so I'm glad I'm glad you got to see Alva in the stream. All right, let's let's try and cook with Bloody Queen again. I still don't know what to do with Bloody Queen, but we'll we'll do something maybe. Oh boy, Chinatown. Oh, I can actually try to get that drop down mirror hit in a uh, hotel. That'd be cool. I see all the other Marys do it, but I also don't know how to position my mirror correctly. So uh, I'm gonna mirror that. There's somebody over there. Oh, there is. I'm just gonna swap. Hello. Oh, there you are. <laughs> Hey, bro, is this Acrobat? I'm pretty sure this is Acrobat. That's Acro. Okay. Just gonna peeper that. Hey, buddy, where are we going? Oh, Mary. <laughs> I don't know how to play you. Um, let's see. Wait, I just set up Mirror here and I get a free hit. Uh, I'm trash? I'm bad? He's bad? He's cornering himself? Bro, I don't know why you did that. I'm Mary. I don't know why he did that. Swippity swap. Here we go. There's my insolence. Let's go. <laughs> they know I have insolence now. There's no way. I can go around. Ooh, peeper. I'm just going to wait for my mirror, bro. Like, I'm just going to wait for my mirror. Here we go. Mary mirror. No, rotate towards it. Where are we going? Oh my gosh, I'm throwing. Oh, I don't know how to play Mary. Swippity swap. Okay. Bro, I am throwing. I don't know how to play this character. My mirror placements are like the worst thing of all time. He did it! I even looked and he came back and did it anyways. Oh my gosh. Break that pallet. Oh, I'm getting Cypher rushed. Why did it go so far? Oh. Nah! Nah, how do you play this character? The mirror makes no sense. Oh my gosh. I can't even drop down mirror hit, bro. Oh, this is depressing. It's always the hackrobats, bro. <laughs> Why can't they be more like my mic, huh? Why can't they all be more like my mic? Yo, he's crazy with it. Hold on, let me watch this drop down mirror. Why is it so far away? Dude, how does mirror work? I don't understand. Uh, I don't know how this freaking character works. How do you freaking aim with mirror? It doesn't make any sense. And I don't have trade swaps, so I can't get off these stupid peepers. Oh my gosh, dude. Uh, I'm switching targets at this point. You there. Help. Give me presents. How does that miss? How does that miss? I don't understand. Yo, why are there always walls in my way when it's me, man? How does that miss? Wait, where'd you come from? How'd I get the acrobat down? Bro, I wasn't even trying to go for you anymore. I swapped. <laughs> I don't understand. How are all the Marys so good with this thing, dude? Uh, oh, the Cypher's primed. Wow, who could have thought? Why do you have Tide? Ugh. Why are we all here? Oh my gosh. He's just gonna go upstairs. Ah, <laughs> uh, what do I do? Peepers, do something. <laughs> uh. Yo, what? Dude, this makes no... What are you doing, bro? He wants to take the kite because he has like a thousand ways to kite. Oh my gosh, bro, I don't know what to do. Why'd you guys make me do this? I'm never playing Mary again, bro. This sucks. I don't know how to aim with the stupid mirror. Why is it so close now? Oh my gosh. And now I can't go. Yo, how do you actually play this character? There's so much stuff in your way. I need the charge attack speed boost, bro. Ugh. Oh, right, no detention, great. Guess who literally gets out for free because I don't have detention. <laughs> oh my gosh. 
please, bro. Oh my gosh. Oh boy. Dude, I didn't even get to see the melee. This is so sad. How do you literally hit anything with this? How do you walk in a straight line? I don't understand, bro. I'm not gonna hit the bees. I just don't get it, bro. I just don't get it. How do you aim with this character? What? I don't understand. How do you aim with this character? Don't ever touch her again. I don't like playing this character. I told you that already. <laughs> I don't play this character. Oh gosh. How do all the Marys, when I when they use their mirrors, they can just walk in a straight line and it always hits me, but whenever I do it, I run into a wall. Okay. God, I'm never playing Mary again. That sucked. That was a horrible experience. What the heck do you do with this character? <laughs> How do they all get the mirrors to like go through all the things when there's just stuff in your way constantly? I don't understand how so many characters just don't work for me, but like with other characters or with other players, it's just like it feels like they can do literally everything. Like Mary feels so broken to me, but I play her and I, she feels like a freaking sock, like she's just sitting there. Oh boy. Anyway, we can no longer see Melly unfortunately, because she has been globally banned. Uh, along with Antiquarian, Patty, and Psyche. But we are actually seeing Dancer on Chinatown. Um, they are, they're banning Opera Singer and Bonbon. Bon. So they're like banning like this Thai God and, you know, Opera Singer as they should. Um, Priestess, Aeroplanist, Mercenary banned from the Hunter side. Officer again. Lots of, lots of Officer, honestly. I mean, to be fair, they're banning they're banning Aeroplanist and Mercenary, the two like other best rescuers. So that makes sense, honestly. That makes sense. Toy Merchant ban, I guess, is fine. Ooh, Nort! Hold on. Wait a minute. We got some Nort gaming. He's dying. All right, who's the hunter though? Who's the hunter? It's Chinatown, so we can see Smiley. We can see a wheel. Uh, we could see a wax. We could see a naiad. We could see a geisha. What are they gonna pick? What are they gonna pick? If they want to secure like draws, don't pick disciple again, bro. Please don't pick disciple again. Please, please pick a different hunter. Come on. Geisha's so good. Just pick geisha. Geisha's so good on this map. Please just pick geisha. Please just pick geisha. Come on. Dream Witch, maybe. Do we can see Dream Witch? We can see Dream Witch. I'll, I'll take a Dream Witch. I'll take a Dream Witch. Just don't be like something lame like a wax artist or a disciple. Be something cool. Be a geisha. Be a Dream Witch. I'll take a Nyad. I'll, I'll, I'll take a Nyad. Weaver? I'll take a Weaver. I'd love a Weaver. I would love a Soul Sweaver. Alright, here we go. Come on. Come on, Geisha. No, man. Cringe artist. Oh, man. oh boy, here we go. The wax. Wax, bro. 4K. Oh man, really, wax artist. Uh, it's. I guess it's Japan, so they just want to play it safe. Uh, he doesn't deserve the 4k. I mean, I, I guess I can see the no geisha because there's a dancer, and I feel like dancer does good against geisha because she drops slow boxes and can just extend tight kite. Lukino, I would I would have loved to see Lukino here, but I don't I don't know if this is his best map because of all like the two story areas that you can hide in. Like there's there's the connected area, there's hotel. Um, obviously, anywhere if you have anywhere in the open, there's also like underneath the little uh, bridge. I feel like there's like lots of places where he just can't jump. But wax, bro, I don't want to watch a wax, bro, dude. I don't want to watch. Yeah, I feel like I feel like as much as I do think Geisha is good on this map, like against this comp, probably not. And Nyad, I feel like Nyad could have been okay, honestly. 
But Wax Artist is stronger than Nyad, so I guess I see it. It makes sense, it makes sense. He, he's good on Chinatown. He has wind potential. Yeah, this this just makes sense, honestly. Wax has the most annoying last presence. Uh, out of all the hunters in the game, full presence. Wow. Yeah, I think I, I think I, I think I would agree. I think I would agree with you. I think I would agree with you. Hold on, let, let me see here. Out of all the hunters. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, no, 100, 100%. 100% most annoying last presence ability is Wax. Hot Wax is so stupid, bro. Yeah, po point and click adventure character for sure. No hate to the players or anything, but Wax Artist is just, um. In my opinion, not a very hype character to watch. Not very hype. I, I honestly, I, I look at this character, maybe, uh, maybe again, this is just like a Mary effect or whatever, where I look at Mary and I'm like, how do you lose with Mary? I, I look at this character, I'm like, how do you lose with this character? I just don't understand. I mean, pro pro players can like make it happen. Early, good, good rotations already. I see them all running around here. Um, ideally... <laughs> Yo, the freaking <laughs> wax jank, this is so goofy. I feel like ideally the first, the best chase target here is probably... <sighs> I actually don't know. Maybe the dancer? She's got boxes posted up. He just breaks this. Ooh, that's a good box placement behind the door. That's a good box placement. Yeah, so at, at this point, this is good because he's just going to force dancer. He's going to break all dancers' boxes. And just waste it. Look at how much time that this is wasting. Yep, she could just rotate, constantly rotate for free, breaking the boxes, going back towards the seer who's camping in hotel. This is he's just getting rotated. Like there's not much cipher progress, but he's getting rotated. He has no teleport. He has he has he has blink. Yeah, bro, wax off that cipher. Woo! Wax off the cipher that nobody's by. Let's go. <laughs> Focus your attention on waxing off the cipher that nobody will arrive at. And by the time they rotate anyway, they're <laughs> Whatever. Dude, he's getting rotated so hard. It looks like he's gonna end up chasing the seer. And look at that, beautiful. He's waiting for this. Oh, wait, the bait though. But he real. now he realized, he realized. He didn't see him drop down. Good. The rotation is so good. I mean, the ciphers aren't really that great either, but that's just because he's been rotated. Whoa, he just blinks. Yo, whoa. Oh. But why though? But why? Why would you vault the pallet at that point? Hello? Okay, he is running the Watsunuki skin. That's pretty cool. I don't know why you go back to... Well, I mean, I guess... I guess he does just get a hit there then. You know what? Never mind. I can see it. I can see it. That all would have lasted long enough. And then... Boop! Dang, that was a... I mean, he did blink. But like... Yeah, I guess it was part of the blink. It was because of the blink. He goes back up here. No more god pallet though. Um, is Seer just dead? No, you know what? He's just doing this to break line of sight, break line of sight for Max. Oh, he messes up! He messes up! Hold on, he gets a little extra distance from that. Okay. And he doesn't have Wax Bomb or anything, so he can't Wax off. He's still dead, though. Oh, good bait! He's still dead, though. Yeah, he's still dead, though. That was not that great of a kite, honestly. That was not that great of a kite. But two ciphers are done. It was because the rotation. The rotation made that good. The rotation made that good, though. And gonna chair right here. Officer was coming nearby. Dancer is here too. She still has another box. Looks like she's setting up a slow box over here for a potential rebound. And he waxes off her cipher, and now she just has to stand there. <laughs> Engaging gameplay. All right, buying time with the watch, of course. Swinging, swinging. That's kind of just what you want to do. You kind of just want to swing. Oh, that wasn't a hit. Wow. He got the hit on the seer? What? He got that? That's actually kind of crazy. And I, I honestly can't believe that. That is kind of crazy. Why did he blink there? I, he just wanted He just wanted to get closer to him. He forced out Al by doing that, and then, like, where was the seer supposed to go after that, honestly? Protector can't make it. He makes it to this chair. Um, and he's already here, so he's going to be forced to rescue early, and then he's going to have hot wax, and... Does he just not see him? Does he just not see the prospector? 
He gets the hit. Early rescue. You got to harass now, Nor. We that's a ooh that was a good stun. Beautiful stun. All right, come on, Nort. Oh, beautiful, beautiful. Oh, rip. Kind of mid. All right, all right. There's hot wax. Hold on. Ooh, good palace stun, but that adds wax to it because you. Oh no, the wax the wax bomb doesn't hit. It doesn't land. It doesn't land. Wax. Hold on. Hot wax is still. Why does hot wax last so long? What? It lasts forever. He breaks out of sight though. No, this hot wax is useless. He got an owl. Hold on, wait. Wait. Hot wax is over. It's on cooldown, and he has an owl, and the cypher's almost primed. Nort, you just got a body block now. Yeah, Nort just body blocks. He's on Nort. He's wasting time. Oh my gosh. Wax artist, you're throwing. He's throwing. Pop. He's throwing. <laughs> <laughs> Could it be four escape? I doubt it. This is a this is a three escape. This is a three because he's nowhere near dungeon. And they don't have tide. One last magnet. Boop. Bad stun. He can just he can really just blink if he wants to. Oh. Uh huh. Wait, what? How do they not have that gate open yet? How do they not have that gate open? Also, wait, did he send him an owl and still died to hot wax? Am I stupid? I don't even know, bro. He's missing a lot, probably nervous. I guess that's true. I mean, the, the, the harassment from Norton was really good because he would have got that hot wax hit on the seer, but the harassment was just really good. Because he, he had 81 hot wax. If he hit him like five more times. Ooh. Wait, he found out the seer. Wait a minute. No, this is this is three escape. They get that gate open. Prostrator makes it out. Wax artist is not fast enough to get over there. Uh, no, they, that's three escape. That's a three escape. Well, this just gives a bigger lead for um for Axis. It, it's not looking good for um WL here. Yeah, it's not looking good for them. They're 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 behind. They're but they need a 4K to catch up. They need a 4K to catch up. I think. Oh, that's not good. Yeah, that's that's that's, that's not great, honestly. L wax artist. Yeah. I mean, is it the early rotation was so good though? The early rotation forcing him to use the blink just for the first hit, like that was just such a good rotation early on. Like it just looks like Axis is taking this. I'm pretty sure. I'm pretty sure it's over for WL here. I hate to say it. I'm pretty sure it's over for them. I mean, the wax artist pick was good. I can't lie, but um, he, he just. He just got rotated so well. He got rotated so well. Yeah. Should have picked Dream Witch? Maybe. I don't even know. I'm not sure what they're going to choose next, but yeah, that's, that's the second set. That's the second set. So, um... Now? <laughs> yeah, see, they... I, I don't know how WL comes back from that. They're, they're going to need, like, a four escape or something. I don't know what they do. I'm not sure what they do in a situation like this. I really don't know. <laughs> oh wait, let me let me end this. Hold up, let me end this. I keep forgetting to end the polls, dude. All right, what's our what's our meme pick now? What's the meme pick? Oh yeah, Mr. Feast. That's right, Mr. Feast. Mr. Feast. Mr. Feast. All right, but hold on. What's the build, though? What's the build? What's the optimal build here, friends? It is a cool skin. Yeah, we're, play we're playing the Koa skin for Koa, indeed. Excitement feaster. <laughs> Detention and confine. All right. Up, down, excitement. Will the excitement even be... Okay, there is a Norton. Oh, happy birthday. Happy birthday, Kurt. They have a puppeteer, bro. Wait, I could just I could just meme on him. I could literally just meme on him. Dude, my, my feast is so bad without Patroller, though. 
You should only try to hit with your tentacle? Sure. <laughs> Why not? Why not make it harder for me? You know what? Why not? My Mr. Feast is already bad enough. But, um, only tentacle hit? Sure. <laughs> what the heck? Wait, no, but I can't get my deduction then. It's a Norton! Come here, bro! Wait, is that Nort? Or is that Puppet? Wait, that might actually be Puppet. Hold up. That's Puppet! Hold on. Puppet. He uses Lewis! He's damaging himself! Let me set up this confined space. <laughs> <laughs> what you gonna do now, huh? He didn't use Lewis. I'm crying. I was hoping he would at least use Lewis. Please use Lewis. Use Lewis, dude! It, you can make it easier for me if you use Lewis. Please use Lewis. Is that still blocked off? It's not blocked off. I can't hit him with normal attack, but he doesn't know that. Bro, please use Lewis. Please use Lewis. How does that miss? How does that miss? How does that miss? Tell me how that misses. Tell that. How, tell me how that misses. Can why aren't you all, like all the other puppeteers that spam Lewis? Bro, you are not even a puppeteer. Spam Lewis! Please! Use him! Yo, you are not a real puppeteer main. Thank you! Finally, he uses Lewis. Oh my gosh, finally. Alright. Where are we going? Where are we going? Huh! Get him! Yo! Thank you for using Lewis. Yeah, get him! Yes! <laughs> then we just go in the basement! Yes! He killed himself for me! <laughs> oh boy. Oh boy. Yes. Yes. <laughs> he is probably confused. But I can't use basic attacks. Alright. Nobody's getting in here. Nobody's getting in here. <laughs> what? Orphy, die! <laughs> hey, journalist, what's up? Hey, journalist. Get her! Man, I sure would love to use my... Man, I would love to just freaking... Boy. Oh boy. <laughs> I want to know what they're thinking right now, dude. I want to know what they're thinking so badly. Oh, I want to know what they're thinking so badly. <laughs> I mean, this is a draw. This is just a draw. This is just a draw. Okay. Sure, bro. Go ahead. Oh no, I'm so scared. Ah. Uh, oh no. Cool, bro. Waste your magnets. I'm chilling. Cool. Waste your magnets for endgame. Sure. <laughs> you think you can just walk past me? Well, you're right, because I can't basic attack you. I can't basic attack! I can't basic attack! You like my confined space? I need tentacles, bro. I need tentacles! I need tentacles! Oh, I have no tentacles. <laughs> what are you doing? I literally... Where'd she go? Where'd she go? Oh, there you are. Oh, boy. <laughs> oh, this is so goofy, dude. This is so goofy. This tentacle has to count, though. Oh, no. Oh, please. Don't go through windows. I can't see you. They just pop! No! They figured out my master plan. 
The feaster with detention that can't even use detention. Get her. Trash. <laughs> I want to use my basic attack so badly, bro. I want to use it so... That should have hit Doofy at least. Oh, I want to use it so badly. I want to use my basic attack so badly, but I literally can't. Can you stop looping factory? I can't do anything here. <laughs> Why did you guys make me do this? Oh my gosh. Ugh. Why is it back there? No way, dungeon is here. Oh. Explorer, don't leave. Man, I sure do wish. Wait. 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 Can I just hit you with these? Man, I sure do wish I could basic attack. <laughs> oh, <laughs> that was 4K if I could basic attack. Oh boy. I almost had it. I almost had it with the full presence. Almost, dude. Almost. Oh boy. Oh wait, the- oh my gosh, the next match is almost ready. Is it? It's another freaking wax artist! No! No, 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 no. Oh my gosh. Hold on. That's my own voice. <laughs> okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. Okay, cheerleader! Wait, whoa! Enchantress Cowboy! Mercenary, cheerleader versus... Wax are if they ban Melly, I hate them. Okay. Here we go. Cowboy and Chiller is crazy. Actually, this whole team comp is kind of crazy. Versus a Wax artist too. Okay, another Wax match. Not, not great. Not great, honestly. Uh, but it makes sense. It makes sense. Okay, let's see. Wait, Lily could refresh the cowboy lasso cooldown if he misses. Enchantress cowboy is a decent combo. Mm. I'm actually curious about this team comp. I can't even lie. <laughs> oh, wait, hold on. Let me get the poll. Do we get a cringe artist 4k? Start poll. Enchantress versus I feel like Enchantress kinda of loses to Wax though, yeah? Like what if she's if she stuns, it doesn't matter. Because the thing about the thing I don't like Enchantress because I main Nightwatch and like she cancels win with stuns and then puts me into cooldown, which I really hate. And sometimes I don't even I don't even get Windwalker from it. But when you're Wax it doesn't matter, you can just be like, oh let me just uh oh, she stunned me. <laughs> like, it doesn't matter. Uh, but they need they need a four escape here to catch up. They need a four escape, and with this team comp, I mean, eh. I mean he has teleport, teleport, insolence, detention. Wow. Okay. He really wants that wax bomb, I guess. We're gonna see the Doma Key mercenary once again. Tide, Tide, Tide. Three Tide Turners. They're playing this like it's Opera Singer. The only one without um Tide is Enchantress with Flywheel. So they probably, they probably want Enchantress to take the kite. What were they expecting here? And why are there so much Enchantress games all of a sudden? I don't know, dude. I don't know what's up with this. <laughs> this looks so goofy, dude. All right, again, good good rotation, though. Good rotation. Chiller's kind of rotating into him. And we see an early beep beep. Okay. And she refreshes her beep beep. Okay. Beep beep again. Nice. Just break line of sight. Yeah, just break line of sight. Now you're in restaurant. He's going to go through the window, get away from there. All right, both beep beeps have been used, though. So now she has to rely on rock hiding until it recharges. Which I believe beep beep. Cooldown is 30 seconds, but the beep beep itself takes 50 seconds, I think, to recharge. So, and boop, there's the first hit. And now he has insolence, okay. This is not a great kite, honestly, I can't even lie. It's not that good of a kite so far. She used up both beep beeps, and for what? And for what, dude? Yeah, wax bomb, wax bomb. And can't make it to the pallet, boom, that's a down. That is a pretty fast down. I can't even lie, that is a fast down. 
and the harasses are not here. But we're going to have to see how this tide, uh, all, all these tides go. I feel like it would have been better for her to have flywheel or something there. All right, and Chair just is here. Kind of chaired on the cipher. She doesn't even care. She's like, sure, go ahead, bro. <laughs> she doesn't care at all. She couldn't care less. She's like, no, I'm still going to decode it, bro. Go ahead. Oh, now she's here. All right. Um, they're both here. They're double rescuing this. They really want to keep her alive. Um, but I can see why. Like, they, they need a four escape to catch up. I don't even know if this ends the set. I don't even know. But we'll see. Oh, we're running into him. Okay. Well, now that's a max presence wax art. Dude, this is just a 4K. This is looking like a 4K, dude. Because Lily goes down. It really depends on the harassment here. Oh, oh. Enchantress stun? Enchantress stun? He, he drops that in time? Wow. Enchantress and Cowboy here, but Enchantress goes down. And the only one decoding is the Mercenary! Woo! Cypher Rush Mercenary! Yeah! Woo! Cypher Rush Merc. Literally just Wax Bomb. Just Wax Bomb. Wax Bomb the window so he can't go in and out. Then you just get him. There you go. Frozen. Can't harass. And put Lily back on the chair. This is a 4K, dude. This is a 4K. It is actually a 4K. I'm pretty sure. Because Mercer is the only one decoding. Merc coder. Born to rescue. Forced to decode. All right, they're double rescuing again. You'll love to see it. He's body blocking the lasso. Lasso's in. Wax, wax, hot wax. Here's hot wax, okay. Ooh, a three stun though, a three stun. But he gets hot wax on cowboy, hot wax on cowboy. Yeah, gets hot wax on cowboy, yep. She had to use beep beep. She has rotated all the way around, so he has to go all the way around, but like this is still not looking good. Oh wait, the cowboy, wait. That was good. Hold on. Wait a minute. If the cowboy and the cheerleader combo can do something here, then maybe. His lasso's back up. As long as he can keep lassoing. Oh, hold on. The supporting of the supporter. Cheerleader and cowboy. Wait. Wait, they're cooking. They're cooking. Hot wax is back up, though. Hot wax. Oh, no, it's over. Oh, he doesn't even... Whoa! Why would you beep beep into a wall? What was that avoiding, huh? I don't understand. Um, yeah, don't bring Tide to your leader. Oh, the cowboy! Wait! He's cra Well, he's... There's nowhere to go. He's dead. Okay, never mind. If there was somewhere to go, that would have been high. If he could have vaulted that pallet, dude, that would have been good. Oh. Okay, he wants that cheerleader dead. Yep. All right, so maybe not a 4K, because the ciphers have come along a little bit now. Um, but yeah, cheerleader's gone. Cowboy puts on gets put on chair. He's been playing the game, like, in this corner the whole time. <laughs> Somehow they found a way to do ciphers, though. Kind of crazy. The Mercoder is out there doing his thing. But they only need two ciphers, and they're both at 70. That's actually... Oh, wait, no. This one... That one is at 70, I'm pretty sure. I'm pretty sure that's the one at 70. Yeah, because that was Patty's cipher at the start, so... He's cheering on a cipher. Nobody can rescue safely. This is still pretty bad. This is still pretty bad, because no, no one can come in. Patty has no stuns. Hot wax is up. They finish a cipher. I think they literally just are feeding, feeding tinnitus and selling. Then Mercenary opens up the last cipher. Dang, dude. 3K? 4K? I can, they, he can still 4K this, but like... I don't know. Cowboy's almost dying. Are we going to see Mercenary rescue? Are we really going to do this? Um, They're double rescuing it. Mercenary's coming, okay. I mean, they kind of have to. They can't just sell or else they keep losing. Hot wax, here we go. Boop, boop, boop. Cowboy goes down, mercenary goes down. Yeah, that's a 4K. They can, they can try and push that cypher, but it's a wax artist, bro. He just waxes it off, and what does he do? He's just sitting in the pallet with no fear. He doesn't care. And down, down, down goes the enchantress. Yep, that's it. That's it. That's a 4K. That's a 4K. 
Yep. They needed a 4 escape and they got a 4k. The winner is Axis, yep. There was nothing that they could do. Alright guys, so I think we learned. Um, don't bring Tide on Cheerleader. Enchantress is not good in tournament. Cowboy could be good in tournament, but um... Yeah. All those Tides for nothing? Yeah, all those Tides for nothing. Man, that was that was just unfortunate for uh for the other team. I can't even lie. They put up a good fight, but I, I felt like it was just it was so strongly in Axis's favor. So strongly. The bop artist. Well, for those of you who said no 4K, we got the 4K. First 4K of Koa, by the way. First 4K of Koa, and it's from Wax, bro. That's funny. Oh boy. I don't even know what they were supposed to do there. I don't know how to win against Wax, dude. Yeah, it's it's the weird team comps, honestly. It's it's a really weird team comp. I can't even like when I when I saw it, like cheerleader, mercenary, enchantress, cowboy, like three characters with decoding debuffs. Like I feel like maybe on theory, like on paper, because like cheerleader can reset cowboy and they can support each other, but like with wax starters, I don't know. Will there be a Dream Witch soon? I don't. That, that's the thing. I don't know. When it comes to Dream Witch, we're probably not going to see her in round one. I mean, there, there, there are some Dream Witches that come out in round one because the team comps are so opera oriented. Um, but most of the time, we see we see operas. It's most of the time it's just operas round one. That, that's mostly what we see. Um, but that's the set. That's the first set, and they finished that relatively quickly, honestly. Uh, but the next set is My versus AWG, and I'm pretty sure AWG is like pretty uh, like a pretty strong team. Like I feel like I recognize that name. I'm pretty sure they're a strong team. So, uh, I feel like AWG takes it, but I also am just, like, not super, uh, knowledgeable about the teams yet. So, that that's the next set that we got. I'm curious to see that, uh, what we're going to, uh, see when it comes to that next set. But now, um, I'm gonna go grab some water. So, I'm gonna put on a Spectate the Pros match. And, oh, there's a Yuko Geisha. People like Geisha, right? Yeah, well, I'm gonna put on this Geisha while I go grab some water. So, I'm gonna be right back. Um, as we prepare for the second set coming, I don't know how long it's going to take, but they, they usually take like a half hour in between sets or, uh, matches, sets, whatever, people, whatever. You know what I'm trying to say. I'll be right back.
Bro, the music stopped. That's cringe. Okay, hold up. All right, Geisha. What the heck? What am I witnessing? Okay, uh... What the... Uh, presence farming? Hello? Sorry about the music that stopped. I forgot I didn't have it on loop. Anyway, I was gonna eat these raspberries that I have in the morning, but I guess I'm gonna eat them now. I'm kind of hungry, and I really want these raspberries. Is that her, that's her first chair? What the heck? I guess it is a perfect. What the? Nah, only one cipher left. What is that even at? Seventy-one. Dang. She's getting cipher rushed. I wasn't even gone for that long. She literally just got cipher rushed. She's not even a full prez. Against a perfumer. She didn't even swing at the perfumes, huh? The blink was weird. Oh, sad. They just pop. Wow. That's a three. That's a three escape. Wee. She's so slow without that, man. She's so slow without that full prez. And. Ooh, tire shock. Nice. They do. Yeah, she gets that. Oh, that was a teleport. I thought that was an emote. <laughs> Geisha's hitbox is so... Whoa, nice. Wait, that's a top... Oh, Wildling is here. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Hold on. Hold. Hmm. This Wildling is buying a lot of time, but his boar is almost out. They're all here. Um. Wait, but they just open gate and then... Hmm. Perfumer can self-heal, though. I wonder what happens here. Is she gonna go back for perf? If she goes back for perf, they rescue prisoner, open the door. Hmm. Uh-oh. Somebody overcommitted. That was smart. Oh. Yo, go for the psych. Go for the psych. Yes. Beautiful. She has nothing. She's dead. Flywheel. Okay, never mind. Geisha's hitbox. The rescue prisoner, just, just, yeah, just don't let them open the gate. As long as you, that, as long as the gate not open, you're fine. His boar is ready again, Pumba. They're all here. This is actually so funny. Okay. <laughs> well, never mind. She probably she just didn't want to deal with it. Honestly, with four people there, the about to run out. I wouldn't want to deal with that either. I totally get that. Alright, I do want to finish these raspberries, so I'm going to watch one more. Let's see. What the heck dock skin is that? I don't think I've seen that before. Hmm. Dang, not a lot of matches. Um. Not a lot of high tier matches. Weird. No, that was not a co-op match. What? <laughs> that was not a co-op match. That was a spectate the pros. You think I would leave during a co-op match? Heck no. Okay. Um. None of these matches are super interesting to me, honestly. None of these are really speaking to me. Hmm. Maybe the painter game. I don't want to watch Doc. No. Doc is boring. <laughs> I play right now. Will you spectate me? Uh, probably not. I don't know how close the second set is. Ooh, Smiley. Hold on. Wait, what the? What the? I don't think I've seen this skin before. This is goofy. What the heck? What is this skin? Look at his little hat! That's adorable! Hmm. Okay, this is kind of a hype team. We got Goat of Goetia, Chinese Near Ante, Small Child, Limited Painter, and this goofy smiley skin. What? People are saying the painter skin is ugly? It's not ugly. It looks just fine. It's got little feathers in his hat. Ooh, good, good, good work from Auntie. Okay, cancel the stun. Wait, he's not running insolence. Wait, what is this smiley build? Peeper? P 
Peeper Smiley? No Inso? Hmm. This is a choice, that's for sure. Anti's throwing, Anti's throwing, okay. This is a weird game. You know, to be fair, maybe he's maybe he's playing games like like me, like me as well. Peeper Smiley. He doesn't know about Listen Smiley. He doesn't know about Listen Smiley. Ooh, rip. He needs insolence, bro. He needs insolence so badly. You have four rockets. What are you doing? Put on a rocket, please. Please, just just rock it. Even if she cancels it, at least it's something. You can you can bait it. Oh my gosh. He's getting memed on. Please hit. The flywheel, no! Oh my gosh. Please use your ability. Norton's throwing. He's the flop of Goatia. You gave him presents! You can dash! Please, yes! That's not gonna make it. Mm. Oh, what? Oh, it ended and then she canceled it, rip. Too bad she didn't cancel it mid uh, animation. It would have been a half cooldown. Okay, she doesn't make that. Bruh. He should have brought listen. He should have brought listen, bro. He should have brought listen. Okay, you got your down finally. Let's go. Let's go. That was a dash hit too, because he was disarmed. But you can still use your abilities when you're disarmed. This is not my smiley. What? How dare you? My listen smiley is the closest thing to God. He doesn't make that. All right, Flop Spectre, what do we got? Okay, cancels. Uh, reduce cooldown dash. Good body block. Okay, hold on. Go, go to Goisha. No longer Flop. But the Cypher's primed. It's not even primed. What? Okay, that stun didn't matter. And... Good. Okay, that was good movement. That was good movement. He's at full pres now. Norton has no... No, he still has one magnet. He threw it, but he's... Where did, it didn't even let he missed. He just missed. He literally just missed. Okay. We're giving free rescue now. Hmm. What are we doing? They have two ciphers ready. This doesn't matter. They have a second cipher. Well, I guess it's only a 23. But now they're healing the antiquarian. Um... Good attempt to go back away from it, but what are we doing here? Do you have confined? He has confined? What? What's your bill? Detention? Are you up down peeper? There's no way you're up down peeper. Page, he makes that. Thanks to full prez. Might be a 3k? Really? Really? You think so? You think so? Are we certain? I can't even lie, that was really depressing. Let's watch a person who actually knows how to play Bloody Queen. Sorry, I'm almost done with these raspberries. He did surrender, yes, he did surrender. <laughs> Poor guy. All right, we got Evil Dragon Bloody Queen, Enchantress, Dancer. Oh wait, Peter called out, they're in the chat sometimes, let's go. Perfumer, Composer, with the accessory. You love to see it. Alrighty, down goes the last raspberry. Delicious. Yo, move! It's such a laggy game, what? Sometimes they take a second, I don't know why. Sometimes they take a second. That, that composer's name is literally raspberry time. What the heck, what a coincidence. That's hilarious. What the heck? Their name is literally Raspberry Time, bro. Shout out to Raspberry Time. That's me playing Mary. You're an evil dragon. What? That's me playing Mary. What a coincidence, dude. That's actually such a coincidence. That's a composer too. Let's go. 
Okay, mind game, mind game. We got pallet, we got pallet. Oh, he just runs past it though. Does she pick up on that habit and just disrespect it now? She does not, nope. Boop, that hits. I think she I think she has a charge attack uh, speed. She might have that. Hello? Oh? We're cooking? Okay, that was actually some good dodges. I can't even lie. Blink not used though. Did not force out Blink. Unfortunate for raspberry time. But that was good deal. Didn't even drop the powder or anything, saving it, because that's a really good palette. Um, good work so far. We have Perfumer gonna come in. Yeah, it's it's it's, it's a family battle right now. Why would he stand still? I mean, he was kind of stuck. To be fair, he didn't really have anywhere to go. And he he might have thought the mirror wouldn't have hit him. Honestly, all right, let's see. Ooh, hold on. We're cutting it close here. Ooh, good, good. That was good. That was good, actually. That was good. Good flywheel. Pallet drop, but Mira's here. You gotta get this body block. Oh, unfortunate. No harassers either. Enchant just has no stuns. Alright, well. Box, okay. Potential rebound kite. We're gonna see a slow box as well. Slow box, fast box, alright. But it's not gonna matter for Mir. Mir's gonna be up. Blink is still up too. She gets blinked down too if she really wanted to. I like the idea, but trait is still a thing. And there's no nobody brings excitement. Oh, rip. Okay. Hits the dancer. And mirror spin. Dude, I, I honestly hate these little flames on arms factor. They make it so hard to see. I hate these. There's there's one by the Shack Cypher. I hate that thing, dude. No, 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 uh. No Terra Shock, that's good. Why are we picking up our boxes? Don't you, want to help, don't you want to help your teammates? The Blink, she misses Blink! Oh, so close! See, that's that's where I would love Flywheel. That's why I run Flywheel Composer, for reasons like that. I don't even know what that the Raspberry Times build is. Um, but Enchantress can still do this, hold on. She can still maybe make this happen, but if she goes down, it's over. Okay. Oh, she's gonna opt to break the slow box. Yeah, I understand that. She's gonna put down a. What the? Wait, can you pick? Can you pick up a slow box as the hunter's breaking it? That's not a thing, right? Actually, wait. The heal composer. They're all here though. Nobody's decoding though. Ooh. Three stun. Okay, now we scatter. Three stun scatter. Three stun scatter. We're all damaged except for the perfumer. She can still heal. Let composer go deco. Oh my gosh, this enchant is cooking. This Enchantress is actually carrying, I can't even lie. She's carrying, dude. All right, Dancer, probably gonna get shoved in a chair now. There's the chair, yep. All right, Perfumer stays here, feeds Tinnitus. Enchantress does indeed have Wanted Order. Is she just gonna leave? She's gonna leave. Cause the thing is, if Enchantress heals the Composer, then, then she's gonna know where Composer is. I mean, she'll know where Composer is anyway because he's gonna be the only one to Cypher. All right, hold on. Raspberry, ta Raspberry time, hold on. Wait a minute. Patty Redemption? Yeah, in, in, a, in, a, in a quick match slash ranked match, maybe. In tournament, definitely not. That was a really bad mirror. But it's okay. She's got adjustment. Oh, now she's got to pay attention to what's in front of her. Don't get... Oh, my gosh. Jeez, wait, was that... I couldn't tell if that was before or after half. I think it was just barely after half. I think, uh, I think it was literally, like, 50.1. I actually don't know. It was really close. It was really close. All right, she's after Enchantress now. Wanted and boop, down she goes. Composer Cypher rushing. This is at 86, but this is her first chair. Um, They should just sell. No, they can see you. She's got Wanted, get out of there. Get out of there. Waiting for Mir. Composer's going to the last cipher. Okay, that cipher's gonna take like 50 seconds to be ready. Probably. Here comes Mirror, and she's clipped. Yep. Not much you can do there with an accurate Mirror and Flywheel. Uh, the next match is starting uh, soon for Koa, but we're good. I think we should be able to finish this match in time. I'm curious to see how it ends. This is gonna be after half. Composer cipher at 26. She could swap the teleport if she really wanted to down the Composer. Um. 
Nope. Gonna opt to pick up Fima Dancer, gets the free rescue, but Dancer, I'm pretty sure, is dead. We're gonna find out right here if it was hit 51 or not. I think it was after half. It wasn't? Okay. And there's a the teleport. Yep, there's a the teleport. Okay. Um, yeah, Composer's dead on Shara, though. And there's the mirror. He's got nowhere to go. Oh? Oh? Oh! <gasps> oh, but the- Oh, dude! That's so unfortunate! He had to vault! He had to vault! That's some, so unfortunate. He almost had that, dude. He almost had that. Raspberry time! No! Raspberry time! I'm so sorry, bro. I'm so sorry, Raspberry time. Why are you here? You know he's dead on chair. Alright, um, now you just appeared- You just brought yourself before Mary just to die now. Your bar time speed is over. Do you have any stuns? All right, Enchant just is throwing. She was carrying earlier, but now she's throwing. Um, I mean, it was probably a tie regardless. I think she probably wasn't keeping track. To be fair, I, I forget sometimes too. Um, but yeah, rest in peace, Raspberry Time. You will be missed. You 100%. What am I looking at? Hold on. What am I? No. Never mind. Okay, a few seconds ago, they had two geishas. Look at that. <laughs> I have two gauges. I don't want to look at Bonathan, bro. Anyway. Rest in peace, Raspberry Time. You fought hard. You fought well. But it is... It is over. It is over for you. Yeah, bon you Bomba, get off my screen. Yeah, I don't want to see a Bon Bon game either, but we might have to see a Bon Bon game. 70% win rate? What? Nah, that's crazy. So I gotta accept my stuff here. Okay, my Spyglass is getting back up there after buying the Coordinator skin. It's getting back up there. I don't know what I'm going to use it on next, though. I'm not sure. But I just know I want to grind it up more. Gotta get those uh, currencies, you know? Alright. Enough of this. Let's get this back in here. Alright, here we go. Time to continue. Yeah, that, that audio is fine. We're good. You main Bon Bon? No hate, no hate. I don't like the character, but no hate. You're fine. Never hate on a player. No. You can hate on a character, but never hate on a player. That's what I, that's what I say. Okay, Charles, 3% win rate, 70% or 70 containment time. I want to see, come on, I want to see some Charles. We're seeing a lot of Charles bans. It's so sad because he's getting nerfed. They're nerfing Charles. Poor guy. Like, finally gets his time to shine in tournament after being forgotten for so long. And then, boom, nerfed. Oh, but Priestess? Nah, we don't need to nerf Priestess. She's fine. Priestess is fine, but oh, Aeroplanus. We have to we have to nerf Aeroplanus. So dumb. He's good. No, Charles is, Charles is really good. He is super good. He has, the thing is, he has, he's just, people think he's just like, oh, he's stronger than mercenary and freaking patient because he has hover and three jetpacks. Um, and he doesn't have any, like, slow decoding time that that mercenary has. So I, I guess I understand, like, the, the decoding. He actually has a small decoding buff of 2% whenever he touches a cypher. And I think it stays on there. I'm pretty sure the cypher buff is, like, whenever he touches a cypher and then it stays like that. I think, I actually don't know how it works, 100%. Um, but I'm really hoping the nerf is, like, hardly anything. Like, if, the, if the nerf is anything, I hope it's, like, I hope it's, like, increased cooldown of jetpack from 15 to 20 or something like that. Like, I hope it's, I hope it's something like that. But bro, they're not gonna nerf Priestess to make it so you can't go through long portals with Tide. Like, they're not gonna make it so she starts with one less portal or something. I don't know. I don't even know, bro. I don't know. Uh, th there's probably a way to nerf Priestess. I mean, why does she have the Omni heal? She doesn't need that. I, I think Priestess healing a little bit faster herself is fine, but why does she give an Omni heal? There's no reason she, she gives an Omni heal across the field. Geisha nerf? No, Geisha doesn't need a nerf. I struggle against Geisha, but she has her weaknesses and strengths. That's the thing. I think she's one of the stronger hunters in the game for sure, but she's not like opera singer levels. They're nerfing. Wait, what? 
Slowed after her dash, heard it in English. Okay, that's rumors, though. If you don't hear it from a, like, a very credible source, then it's not true. The Geisha nerf, I don't think it's been confirmed yet. Geisha doesn't need a nerf. I don't think it's real. I'm pretty sure if they said so, they would have said it in the q and it, it was not in the Q&A. It was not. The, the, thing, the Q&A did not feature anything about Geisha. I can check right now. This is this is the balance. This is the balance section. Soul Weaver buff. Thinking about it. This is mid. Balloons. Freeloaders. Certain score. Nothing. Puppeteer. They're not buffing or nerfing puppeteer. And um, they're they're nerfing aeroplanists. That's all that is. There's nothing about Geisha. I'm pretty. I'm yeah. That honestly, that Q and A sucked. The, la the last like three Q and As have all been terrible in my opinion. They're all so bad. There was a really good Q and A like I think like back in November or something where it had like a ton of adjustments coming to the game. That was a great Q and A. Oh, what the heck? Hold on. Let me let me fix the full screen. Oops. I was Skip to live. There we go. So we're gonna buff in a It said adjustment. Adjustment can be buff or nerf. Um, but I, I, I think they said something about a Soul Weaver skin. I think, I think that was rumored. Sanrio Melee? I don't think Sanrio Melee will happen. They, they already did, like, they already showed off all the Sanrio art. Um, and they are working on a part two of Sanrio. But I, I hope it's Axe Boy. I want Robbie Axe Boy. That's what I want. The, the the Robbie Axe Boy or Robbie that's the same thing sorry Kurobi that's saying Robbie Axe Boy I meant Kurobi Axe Boy I'm stupid sorry guys I'm normally I'm normally like freaking asleep at this time my brain is only at like 50% capacity I meant Kurobi Axe Boy that's what I was trying to say I mean, yeah because they, they had this image they had this image um, this one here where we had uh, everybody else we had Ithaca, Geisha, Grave, Aesop uh, and Nort. And also Kuropi Robbie. This is the one I want. I want I want Kuropi Robbie in the game. Uh, that's who I want. Oh my gosh. What am I doing? I can just press F, dude. My freaking sleep deprived brain, I swear. So Sonic Art doesn't consider the skin coming out? I mean, like, the thing is, they probably have the higher chance that the designs are already there, right? You would think? Did I just say Ithaca? That's how it's pronounced. I'm pretty sure. Alright, here we go. Uh, they're banning... Okay, Moonlit locked. Looks like we're going on Red Church. Where is that image? You can literally just look up IDV Sanrio collab and it should show up. But it was... Itaokua? Itaokua? Oh, yeah, that's what I thought it was for a long time, too. Um, the thing is, I'm pretty sure... Gonna report. Oh, hi, P3 Cloud. Yeah, we saw one of your matches. Or not one of your matches, but a match that you were featured in. Um, nice to see you. I forgot what I was talking about. It probably wasn't important. Oh, yeah. How to pronounce Ithaca. I'm pretty sure it's Ithaca. Yeah, I, um, when I was watching some commentary, people were, uh, people were talking, I think they were pronouncing it, um, like in Japan or something, it's like Itaqua. So that's why I was like, oh, it's Itaqua. Okay, that makes sense. So that's how I started pronouncing it. So, But I'm pretty sure it's Itaqua. Mm. I can literally look it up. I'm pretty sure it's Itaqua. How to pronounce Itaqua. <laughs> 
Cause Ithaca was like a creature, pretty sure. Nothing showing up. Great. Awesome. The Nightshade Diary. You know what that means. <laughs> Check under the bed and make sure no one. <laughs> what is what is this? <laughs> I just clicked on a random video that said Ithaca on it, and now I don't know what I'm looking at. It's all IDV. What the heck? Whatever. I'm too lazy. Oh, I'm too lazy. Ignore, ignore what you just heard. Just ignore it. It was just some stupid video that said Ithaca. Anyway, uh, we got a good round one team comp. Wait, wait, what? Oh, you know what? I, they're probably playing Charles round one um, to be banned because they're probably going to ban him later. But we got we got Gardner, Charles, Seer, Merc. Interesting that we're not seeing any other like uh, niche character coming out. We got some lag. You love to see it. Mercenary's not banned either. Interesting. I didn't actually ban first officer from the hunter side. This is they're obviously ready for a dream, uh, not dream match. They're, they're obviously ready for a an opera. This is obviously a, an opera comp. But is it gonna be opera? It's mostly yeah, it's opera. It's it's, it's freaking opera. I don't know. I don't know why I thought it wouldn't be. But... Yeah, we, we we were just talking about the uh, the the Charles nerf. Uh, ro 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 I'm not sure how to pronounce the name. Uh, but yeah, poor, poor Charles is indeed getting nerfed next season. Um, starting on the 21st of this month. Very sad, honestly. Why do they ban Coordinator? Coordinator is good against uh, Opera. Coordinator is good against Opera. It's a it's a guaranteed rebound, like Coordinator's, and she can get distance with Gun. She's good against Opera. I wonder if they set up the kiting area in the lower left. Uh, against Opera, it doesn't really matter that much. And the the kiting the, the lower left kiting area, the loop is nice, but against again against Opera, it probably can't do too much because uh, she can just you know walk around it once, teleport back whenever she needs to, and then just break the loop instantly. Um, and by setting that up that loop up, it's gonna take time when they could be just cyber rushing instead. Like what you need to do against Opera is again, first person kites, everybody else cipher rushes, and then you just spam two tide turners, and then just keep cipher rushing. That's that's literally how every Opera. That's how the Opera meta is. It's just um, literally that. And then with with, with some uh, with some no borrowed time potentially sprinkled in there as well. Yeah, we haven't, we haven't seen a Night Watch match yet, sadly. I like Night Watch, but um, as you can see, people clearly want to play Wax Artist! Mm. <sighs> Poor Night Watch. Poor Night Watch. I'm gonna go to bed. Oh, thank you for stopping by, Say Say. I appreciate it. Alright, I'm curious, to, I'm curious to see these builds here. I'm curious to see these builds. Let's see what we got. It's already f almost 5 in the morning. I might as well just stay up for the whole thing at this point. <laughs> oh boy, it's it's almost five in the morning for me. Oh boy, I'll just take a nap. I'll just have to take a nap midday sometime. All right, we got the Opera S tier skin. She's gonna be running Blink Trump Card Detention. We got Tide Nidra Reflex on Gardner. Borrowed Time Nidra Reflex on Seer. Borrowed Time Tide on Mercenary and Nidra Reflex Tide on Aeroplanist. So only two characters with uh, Borrowed Time. Kind of standard to see against an opera singer. Uh, ideally, the person to take the kite here is... Nobody has a full kite build. Oh, Aeroplanist is already using the jetpacks. Beautiful. Yep, already getting some distance here. You'll love to see it. Good jetpack work. He can make it to the pallet. Yep. Beautiful. He can go to the window now. Does she go dash to the window? Oh, mind game, mind game. Okay, good, good. Mind game, good. Mind game. And... He just takes a hit here. Wait, jetpack, jetpack. Owl, beautiful owl, beautiful owl. Beautiful owl. Hover, beautiful, yep, shove that, shove that opera back, shove that opera back, get that distance, beautiful work. Get into church. Yes, good work. And he's got the knee-jerk reflex speed now. She blinks, she blinks, hold on. She blinks her first hit, okay. But it's opera singer, she can catch up instantly. One more jetpack, one more jetpack. He used it, he used it, yep, he gets that distance. Yup. Okay. Pallet has been dropped. Can we get a three cipher kite? He can't make it. He can't make it. Man, she's so fast. 
AWG, dude. They, this opera feels so much faster than the other operas. I can't even lie. She feels so much faster. Jeez. That was so fast, dude. That was such a fast time. That was almost a three cipher kite, man. That was almost three ciphers. Teleports back. Uh oh. Garner is coming on in. Bubble is here. Bubble is no longer here. Boop takes the hit. Use that veteran speed boost to get to that chair. And yo, they had like a synchronized moment. Oh, hello. Okay, she was thinking about going for Gardner for a second. She might actually could. She could go for. Nah, she's gonna opt to chase the. No. Oh, she's ca she's cornered. She's cornered. That's. Ooh, lucky, lucky, lucky. That was lucky. That was so lucky. Yep, he's gonna die off in a corner. Yep. And that's the first tie Turner used. Now they then they come in. Now they come in with Mercenary. I'm pretty sure they probably wanted maybe the Seer to take the kite. Well, I guess Aeropetus could last longer because Seer uses his owl for himself, then just dies. Probably best to use the owl to extend the first kite. Yeah. Just just to extend the first kite. So Seer, Seer can just cipher rush and extend first kite while while doing his thing. All right, Mercenary is gonna come on in here. Uh, kind of here a little bit early. Blink is almost back up. Teleports back. Okay. He's got to stall a little bit longer. No, gets hit. Now he has to rescue. He's got to rescue and then just let him die in a corner. He has no room to such. He gets hit. No, Mercenary gets hit. Okay, now he has to play body block now. He's dead. He's dead, he's dead anyway. So I might as well just play body block. Yep. Just, just play body block for him. Just play assist for him. Cause he, he can at least outlast the tie. Oh, careful. He can outlast the tie. Gets the speed from Nidric Reflex. And yeah, he's just kind of cornered here. He has one pallet left. He's got this one pallet. And rip. Terra Shock. But at least you forced her to go around or break pallet. Yep. So it's, a, it's another extra second. It's another extra second. But the Cyphers are coming along pretty nicely. Um, yeah, this is... Oops. Oh, buying a little more time with the uh, the crawling there. Nice. Yeah, this is this is a tie. This is a tie. Well, no, there's still there's still teleport. So this is this is a tie or a three K. There's one down. What? That's aggressive. That's aggressive. Hold on. That's very aggressive. He has no out. Wait a minute. That was such a good play. And he's down. If you guys don't think the opera's the best under the game, just look at this. That was actually such a good play. That teleport changed the game. That teleport changed the game, dude. And now they're nowhere near the Cypher. Mercenary has no self-heal. And she knows that Cypher's being... No, she doesn't know it's working. Oh, she saw the trail. She saw the trail. Teleports back for safety. Okay, understandable. Seer still has a full chair. That, cy that Cypher still can't get primed. Oh, oh, she spotted out Merc. Okay. Merc has two elbow pads. There's one. Neum. But Opera's so fast. She just catches up. Drop pallet, elbow pad. Neum, yep. He makes that, he makes that. He makes it, he makes it, he makes it. Boop, because it's Mercenary. He makes that, baby. Mercenary. Woo. And now... She hits the seer through the mercenary. What? No way. The cypher's almost primed. But then she just chairs both. This is this is gonna be. That's the mercenary's first chair. His chair time is long. It's 66 seconds. She has 66 seconds to find the gardener and kill her. Oh boy. She has. This gardener has to. This gardener has to stay hidden for 66 seconds until they both die. And then also get to dungeon. That's a 4K, dude. That's just a 4K. Dude, the optimal opera dashes. She's so fast. She's so fast, dude. She's just so fast. Yep, cape. Shneum. Shneum. All right. Oh, she's closing in. She's checked pretty much everywhere. Oh, she's closing in. No. She's going back. Wait. She teleports back to chair. Safety, safety, secure the down. <sighs> Can Gardner make it? Gardner's, Gardner's going to hold on. Wait. There's a small chance. There's a small chance she makes it because of Bubble. Oh, Bubble. You have to spot her out early. Oh, she found her. She found her. She found her. Opera. Opera. No. Oh, Bubble, Bubble. Oh, but the teleport. No, she can't. Oh, man. So close. So close. The teleport, dude. That secured her fate. 
Yeah. That was so close. If she could have bubbled, she made it. She made it. But she was too far away. The thing is, bubble lasts for six seconds. That was not six seconds of walking. She needed to be closer. So close. So close. Oh, that was good. That was close. That that's that's opera singer. That is peak opera singer right there. Like the other opera singers, they felt like they're a little slower. That opera singer, not a single dash messed up. It looked like. Not a single dash messed up. That was just that was very good. That that's that's opera singer at top level. Like if if you got if you guys ever like I, I saw some people when I was on Zeus's stream earlier. Some people were saying that like oh I don't think opera singer is that good. Look at this just look at that game and you tell me she's bad. <laughs> There's just no way. She she is 100% the best hunter in the game for a reason. Like we we talk we say that this game is survivor sided, but when it comes to opera singers, it's hunter sided. Opera singer is just so good. She missed up one dash at the beginning. Okay, my bad. A single time. But when it came to those other games that we saw in the last sets we saw like multiple d times where opera is walking if you see an opera that's walking they're not playing opera correctly <laughs> should watch the dong Shuen geisha chinese match just search it up in leo's memory i i have seen dong Shuen's geisha it's broken he he's so good and he he was he was uh he joined another team and dao 5 didn't even qualify this year they didn't even qualify because they didn't have dong Shuen. <laughs> So unfortunate. <laughs> yeah, he's he's crazy. I think he's probably the best hunter in the world. Probably. I don't know if that's true, but he's at least if if he's not best, he's at least top ten, easily. Okay. That was a good match. That was a good match. Now, we do a meme match. Here we go. Let's go back to a meme match. Oh. Why did the song... Okay, the song blew up. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know what was up with that. Oh, the music has been super low during these moments. Hold on. Um, actually, that hasn't been too bad. I will turn it up slightly, though. There we go. Eh, probably, like, right there. Okay, um, what's what's our what's our meme build? <laughs> Antonio Patroller, huh? All right, Patroller Antonio, it is. I mean, that's a free no hit if I could just do it quickly enough. Um, but sure, <laughs> why not? Trade swap detention, or do we want? Do you want our lovely Inso Trace? <laughs> oh boy. No detention. No det yeah, you gotta say no detention. Confined space trump card. Alright, no insolence. Fine. No insolence. Oh, whoops. I don't even think I got, I don't even think I got to finish my persona. Oops. <laughs> I still had points left over. No. I'm missing 20 points on my persona. Oh boy. Where's the BQ patroller? Uh, the BQ patroller I did earlier and I got four escaped because my BQ is complete garbage. I can't, I can't play Blood Queen for the life of me, dude. I can't play Blood Queen for the life of me. But my listen smiley though, four Ks only. All right, oh, it's Priestess on Chinatown, bro. And Explorer, how am I actually gonna do this, bro? What am I supposed to do? Priestess on Chinatown. Oh, baby. Is that what I think it is? Did she go back through? No, she's over here. Is this a priestess on Chinatown? No, she's going into connected. Stop. <gasps> she's not, she's a bot. You're a bot. What? That's it. Come here, Jerry, get her. Yes, Jerry power. I saw that explorer. All right, all right, all right, hold on. All right. Where's the bite? It ran out! Yo, I thought the bite happened so much sooner. Bro, Jerry did nothing. Where are you? Oh. How did that not hit? 
Bro, Jerry ran out. Right at the perfect time for her. Oh my goodness. You like that palette, huh? Bruh. I wish she vaulted that so I terror shocked. <laughs> oh man, that instance would have been real nice, huh? Explorer! I see you, bro! I'm about to just hit the Explorer at this point. I don't see him anymore. No, I still see him. You know what? That's it, bro. I'm bad. I'm so bad. Why is he staying small? He's he's literally helping me win. What? He can do that? I thought he couldn't do that when he was small. Okay. Bro, you're literally... He's literally throwing by staying small. When you're small, you don't have speed. You go slow. I don't know why he's being small. Anyway, get in there, Kurt. Huh. All right, now we throw demon notes around and pray. The second I pick up tonight, I'm, I'm, thro I'm throwing Jerry. Oh, Jerry. Jerry, please. Jerry, do your thing. Where are they coming from? Where? Jerry! Oh, get up. Here we go. Yes, come on, Jerry. Yes. Yes. Wait for it, wait for it, wait for it, wait for it. Come on. Yes! Jerry, too good. Oh, I see Priestess, though. You're ugly. Huh. Full press. Come on. Oh, I have note back. I have note back. Where'd he go? He's small! Bro, how does that not hit? Like, in every universe that hits. In every universe that hits. Oh my gosh. No. Bro! Okay, we're good. Uh, he'd miss his magnet. <laughs> bro, how does that miss? I have to- I have to surrender, bro. The next match is starting. <laughs> I have to surrender! <sighs> he has tied, bro. Hold on, full press, do your thing. Full press, do your thing. Huh. Yes. Yes. Bro, the next match is- It's a Dream Witch! The next match is a Dream Witch! Hold on, I have to surrender. I have to surrender, the next match is starting. <laughs> I didn't think it would start so soon. Okay. Okay. Okay, hold on. I think I saw Mike gaming. I saw Mike gaming. Alright, we surrender. Sorry. Uh, team, whoever I was going up against. Okay, hold on. So we got we got Gardner, Acro, Forward, Dancer against a Dream Witch. Okay. Interesting, interesting. Here we go. Here we go. Mike, game. Oh, this is going to be loud for you. Hold on. Let me turn that down. There we go. Okay, as always, let me know Let me know if the, uh, the audio is too loud for you. Seems like it's okay. But let me know, let me know. Alright. Gardener. No, no, no round one Dream Witch. Actually, wait. This is actually kind of an interesting... Uh, interesting choice. Actually, who, who was their second person? It was Acro. They're not, not going to play Acro for the rest of the set. That's crazy. I mean, Acro versus Dream Witch is okay. Or, Acro versus... Um, Opera, I guess, is fine. I feel like I feel like Akro is not bad against Dream Witch, though. Hmm. Does Gardner do okay against Witch? Actually, I don't know. What the heck are you guys yelling about? Yeah, we do got Mike Gaming. Time for some Mike Gaming. Forward versus Dream Witch, though, I don't know. I don't know if forward is okay against Dream Witch. All right, here we go. Is this the Tommy skin or Tommy skin? I don't know how it's pronounced. All right, well, I'm pretty sure that is the skin that you guys are uh, crazy about. How do you pronounce it? I don't even know. <laughs> All right, anyways. Oh, Mike. Mike from the start already. Leech has been set up. We're chilling, we're chilling. Ooh, 
Oh, good block! What? He tried to firebomb through, but he couldn't because main body. Okay, that that felt like a that honestly kind of felt like a textbook dream much kind of thing. I don't know why he fell for that. And he's transitioning back toward the main body patroller. Hold on. He's dead. He's just dead. He can cancel patroller. No, he can cancel patroller with a jump. He's gonna have flywheel. Cancel patroller. Cancel patroller. Cancel patroller bite. He cancels patroller bite. Beautiful. Drops pallet. He can cancel patroller bite with flywheel. No, he cancels it with vault. Beautiful. He's cutting this patroller really well. Flywheel. Beautiful. Yes. Bomb is back up. Mike gaming. Oh, but he's dead. He's dead. Yeah, well, at least he forced Leech it. That actually wasn't bad. He he kind of he kind of messed up at the start, but that wasn't bad. He cut the patroller, and then he got he down to the, got down to the Leech. That was good. That was good. That was actually really good. The thing is, with patroller bites, they're timed, right? There's there's they're, they're timed on the the bites. I forget exactly how the timing works, but they're that you can time it if you do interactions. Like if you drop a pallet vault to window, it cancels the patroller bite. But if you also do other things like um. All right, here comes here comes patroller again. This I think that was follower patroller. I couldn't tell. Um, this is the gardener actually. Boop takes the hit, and there we go. I don't even think that uh, was necessary. Bubble? Wait, that was such a good bubble. That was such a good bubble. Hold on. All right, and now wait, we're chasing gardener. We're not chasing the acro. Well, I guess Leech is on acro. And main body patroller is almost back up online. We're probably going to see patroller here. Patroller, patroller. Patroller is up. Yep, there's a patroller. Main body patroller. Ngang, 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 ngang. Jerry's back. He's back in action. Boop, down he goes. Dies to Leech again. Has a witch mark. And boop, set back up. All right. This is okay. Th this, this... <sighs> the thing is, once they lose a member, this game becomes a lot harder. ID... Oh, is she trying to drive to... Oh, this is, a bad, this is a bad chair. This is a hard chair to rebound from. Ideally, forward needs to cook. He needs to cook here. Forward needs to cook. I forgot to put up a freaking poll. I'm gonna do it right now. That's it. They, they need to they they oh forward okay he needs to stun he needs to do something here he cook forward cook come on do something forward she could just swap to blink swap to blink for the down she really wants to yeah exactly right on cue there it is swap to blink and forward is not there to harass they're just gonna sell the thing, I guess the thing is, like, they, they got a 4k, so they're in the lead as long as they get people out. So they can, they're, they can sell somebody. <coughs> they're completely fine to sell but, uh, people, because they, they already got a 4k. They're already in the lead. So, the, unfortunately, Mike Gaming is no longer going to game. He is going to die. Wait! Wait! Oh my, he missed! He's a bot! Zeus, is that you, bro? That sucks. He tried, he tried. He used up like all his ball for that. Dang. He really wanted to keep Mike gaming alive, but Mike is no longer gaming. And now this became this just became so much more difficult. Garner sets up bubble. Link is not online. Guarding the cipher. Yeah, because when they're one person short, a dream witch can just snowball now. She disrespects the pallet! 100%! Leech it! They're still working on a cypher, though. She's guarding two cyphers. She's chilling? What? Ooh. Good, 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 good. You see, that, that's good communication right there. Garner was thinking about opening up a chest. Ford looks like he's opening up a chest. If, he find, if they find a syringe or something. Ford found a syringe. That's really good. He found a syringe. That's actually really good. People are thinking we're going to see a Dream Witch 4K, but that Ford syringe is going to be nice. I don't know why she's not setting up... Okay, there it is. Um... Okay, she's just kind of guarding the ciphers right now. She's not really on the offensive. Breaks the uh, breaks the dancer's box. That's the last box. Gardner's going down in the basement to try and find a syringe. <laughs> That's funny. They need items, dude. They need items. Yeah, the thing is, the blink is gonna be coming back soon. Dancer is taking the kite now. Fast box is here. She's just gonna break it. Opting to break it. Yep. Opting to break it. Yep. Forward is here. He's healed. And oh, he actually takes. Wow, that hits. I'm I'm surprised. All right. Um, unfortunately, that syringe is not going to help him at all. 
I think he's I think he's just he's, he's done so here. We see a leech and then blink blink is up. Blink is almost up. He she could just use blink. The ciphers are climbing though. They all have Garner does not have borrowed time actually. Yeah, that's they were probably expecting uh, you know the dream witch or the, the the opera. That's why they have like the opera builds on. That's why it's actually not even bad to run dream witch one, round one is because everybody's expecting opera. And um, Dream Witch can kind of upset some of those uh, potential builds. 3k at most? We'll have to see. They're all at half, but like she's doing a really good job. It's, it, it's kind of like we're kind of stalemating right now. But the thing is, like, at the end of the day, the survivors are going to run out of they're, they're gonna run out of stuff first until they can pop a cypher. Um, but I don't know. I don't know if she knows. She probably knows that the Gardener has no, uh, no BT. She broke some chairs in this area. That's funny. All right. There's another leech. The priority here is let us de leech and heal if you can. Yep. They're healing, they're healing, yep. They don't get the heal off. Yep. They just they can't they can't heal, they can't de leech because of the map pressure. Honestly, like I, I, I was hearing some people talking about Ivy, and people want less super fast chase hunters like Opera. People want more map presence hunters like Dream Witch and whatnot. The blink misses the blink in the fast forward vaulting. Hold on! Zeus redemption! Okay. Can they do this? Can they do this? Oh, a little bit pincered here. Pincered, pincered. Vaulting and hit. Yep. Does go down. Does go down. There. Okay. Uh, looks like the gardener is trying to de leech. And yep, another leech has been set up onto the forward. Oh boy. Yeah, they, they just trade leeches there. Garner loses hers, but forward gates hers. But oh, but the, the cypher, hold on. The cypher, it's almost primed. Wait. Gardner. She just pops. She just pops. Wait, because she has no BT. Uh, wait, no, that wasn't Garner. I'm stupid. That was. The dancer, I'm dumb. Um, but yeah, I guess, yeah. Um, so they're just not going to rescue. I guess they just want to get people out. They just want to get, at this point, they're like, yeah, we need to just get people out. We just need to get people out. We can sell the fort. As long as we get people out, we win. Now she guards dungeon and she guards gate. Oh, but the leech is here. It's not going to, you're not going to make, Gardner, careful. <laughs> oh, she went back for forward. Hold on. Wait. Oh, you're a bot. Garner goes down, but Ford is back up in action. Dude. Dude. They're on the gate. They're on the gate. Picks up Gardner. Okay. Swap, swap. Nice. The pressure, the pressure. Forward, forward, forward. Bro. Bro really wants that gate open. <laughs> um. All right, Ford goes down, but that's it. There's no pressure over there. Oh, can he crawl? No shot, he crawls. She comes over, leeches up in five, four, three, two, one. Leeches up. Uh, she just gets out, right? She just gets out. Yeah, they got a one escape. They got a one escape. They got somebody out. They got somebody out. It's 3K. They got somebody out. Honestly, that's kind of what they needed. They, they got somebody out. So that's 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 something. They're still in the lead. They got the three K. Um, AWG in the lead by one point. That was a good match, though. That was an intense match. Yeah, got she got she got the three K indeed. That was a good match. That was a good match. Good match indeed. And then, yeah, that, that's round one. That's round one. Okay. With round one over, you know what that means. Time for more memes. <laughs> Time for more memes. Oh, boy. All right, let me raise this back up a little bit. And, yeah, of course, um... Yeah, of course my completely garbage, uh... Complete garbage, Antonio did not get a single kill. Listen, Joseph, patroller. No, no, no. This is, I, I don't go patroller. Listen, my, 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 my listen smiley is like listen smiley only. I can't go patroller smiley. Like, what? There, the, where's the meme? Where's the funny? <laughs> Listen, 
listen, Geisha. I could play fish. I already did Peeper Joseph. <laughs> I already did Peeper Joseph. Sea badge for Smiley? I don't know. I don't really play Smiley too often. <laughs> no Tinnitus. Tinnitus is automatically in your kit. You can't remove it. Fool's Gold? But what what build fools? My fools is pretty bad. I don't have Geisha or Wu Chang. Oh yeah, no, 100. percent I still have my S badge Ripper, as always. Patroller. You guys want to see a lot of Jerry today, huh? That's crazy. I don't know what build to go with though. Smiley Peepers, Michi. I don't have Michi. All right, well, I don't have enough time to change it, so we'll just roll with default. This <laughs> Jerry is a meme himself. He is a meme. I love Jerry. Fish Patrol, yeah, no, Naya Patroller is actually good. I don't know how to use Naya Patroller, but Naya Patroller is good. I need to get more Hunters, bro. <laughs> it's just the darn clues I've just having to spend on all the accessories and whatnot, or not accessories, but, uh, Furniture, that freaking dragon furniture, dude. I spent like all my clues on that. But it wasn't S tier furniture and it looks cool, so it was worth. All right, Foolish. You know, it's funny, I actually I actually played Foolish like a lot for like a solid like month. Kind of, kind of when he first came out. Um, actually, if I find Puppeteer, that would be awesome. I found Cowboy. I'm really bad against Cowboy. That was a good bait. Right. Uh huh. Goes around. I'm just gonna keep him away from the pallet until I get my thing back up. There we go. If he wants to go through the pallet, he's gonna have to take a hit. Huh? That was actually kind of crazy. I can't even lie. Okay. Well, I do get a hit. That's good. Um, but he's not gonna expect patroller. Come on out, Jerry! Where'd you go, bro? Oh. <laughs> oh, patroller, bro. Jerry, you will forever be a legend. Whee! Good try, bro! Ugh, Jerry Gaming! <laughs> oh, Jerry. What a, what a guy you are. What a funny little guy you are. All right, get in there, bro. Get in there. All right, let's see. Can I put a rock on that? That's a little too far, huh? Can I put a rock on that? I can put a rock on this. Actually, I could just throw my axe at it too. Hey, who's even over there? Oh, what the? Bro oh, journalist. Oh, she wasted her tide, that's cool. I know you're back there, bro. I can see you. Yeah, I'll wait. <laughs> I'll wait, I'll wait. Let me hit journalist. Yep. Damage. I, he goes down in a chip, so it's fine. Cowboy goes down in a chip. And he's gonna try to go to that pallet. Oh, we don't make it, unfortunate. Drops pallet. You just wait for Jerry, bro. Jerry's coming. Jerry's on his way. Uh, 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 uh. Death. Cowboy speed! He's crazy! Dang, Cowboy's a good kiter, bro. But he died on a Cypher. I dropped. I dropped. We're good. We good. We good. He can do it again, though, if he, if he throws it through the window. He doesn't, though. Rip! I dropped for no reason. Um, He doesn't struggle. Yeah, there we go. Nort, what are we doing? We're going to have to instant rescue. That was a terrible rock. Uh... uh. All right, now go rescue. Go rescue, bro, go rescue. Don't you dare make me use Jerry. No back door? Uh -uh. <laughs> All right, I'm chilling, I guess. Um, yeah, we're chilling here. Boop. Oh, they're not rescuing. How dare you not rescue? Bro, you're gonna abandon your friends? How sad. How very sad. Nobody's here. Where is everybody? Ah, there we are. Whee! 
So much stuff in my way, bro. I hate Leos. Whee! That's it. Jerry, do your thing. Go get him. Get what I cannot. Oh, journalist! Come here! Gang, 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 gang. <laughs> so stupid, bro. Here we go. Now I can play catch up. Whee! Alright. Controller. Uh, oh! Yes! Jerry! Jerry Gaming! He's here? I dropped. I mean. I mean. I mean, uh, okay. Sure. Get in there, bro. Where's the puppeteer? Where's Matthias? He's decoding. <laughs> he doesn't even care. He's just decoding, bro. Well, now I know where he is. The journalist has a long share time. I'm just gonna go after Matthias. I know he's over there. Um, and I think Dungeon was in. Oh. Bruh. I had to menace. Where is he? Puppet, bro. Oh, jeez, there he is. Where? What? Hello? Uh. Lewis? Dang, he kind of just got that, bro. Wait, they can just go rescue journalists now. Don't be behind this pile. I'll cry. Thank you. Oh, he's already dead. Oh, cool. <laughs> I'm just hitting him so many times. He's like super dead, bro. There we go. We got journalists. All right. I don't know where Nort is, but I'm killing this puppeteer. Nort. You want to come harass? Oh, I think I see him. No, that was Doofy's trail. What the heck? All right. They're getting ready for the next match, but I think we can make this. Wait, no, I still have tinnitus. I still have tinnitus. Uh. Huh. Huh. <laughs> Where are you, bro? Hmm. Where are you? Okay. Sure. I'll wait. Actually, I have a pretty funny idea I can use. If he shows up. Okay, he saves Puppeteer. He's ugly. Nort. Bad Nort. Uh. Uh. Hmm. Do I wanna? How do I get out of this? Oh yeah, like that. <laughs> That's funny. Alright, they're gearing up for the- Oh no! I wanted to be funny! They didn't even let me be funny. Well, whatever. Well, Jerry. Jerry Gaming. I forgot to freaking close the poll again. I'm an idiot. There we go. Alright, we did it. Jerry Gaming. Jerry is too good. Alright, just in time. Just in time. Just in time. Let me lower this a bit. Let's go right there. Yo, I got another win. Let's go. Alright, we got Psych and Mike Gaming. There we go. I have played Wheel, yes. I played Wheel, uh, I played the Wheel Brothers on their character day. And I did absolutely garbage with them. Absolute garbage. Mm, that's kind of low, hold on. Eh. Yeah, that's fine. Audio looks good. As always, let me know how it sounds. <clears throat> Alright, this is a pretty safe team so far. Not super, not super hype. Psych, Merc, pretty safe. I do like Mike though. Come on, get, let me see a hype hunter. Let me see, let me see a hype character. Anti Prospect are banned. That's unfortunate. Come on, give me something like Melly. We might see Patient here. We might see Patient. We might see Patient. Another Enchantress. Yo, where? What are these? What? Why Enchantress? Where is Enchantress coming from? I don't understand. This is not a tourney character. So weird. And that's not even their first character. She's not even their first character. So they're not even like... I thought they just picked Patient. It's Moonlit. Patient on Moonlit. That's the meme. And he wouldn't even be banned. Like you're letting you're letting Psych and... Psych and Akka be banned. But you're letting Enchantress stay? Is there... Like have they found something with Enchantress? I don't know, dude. I don't know. It's not gonna be Joseph. Like they're not ever playing Joseph. If it's if it's if it's Moonlit, there's probably gonna play just freaking Wax or something. It's probably gonna be Wax or Geisha. Ooh, maybe a Hermit actually. Yeah. 
No, I'm, call, I'm calling. It's probably not going to be Nightwatch. I doubt it's... Nightwatch? I don't think Nightwatch is great on Moonlight. I, I personally I personally think it's a... Uh, it's it's ge it's Geisha, Wax, or Hermit, most likely. Wu Chang is not a tourney character, unfortunately. Wu, Wu Chang does not come out in tournament. Oh yeah, Mary. Mary could come out. Mary could come out. We could see Mary. Probably one of those four. Wax, yeah, it's Wax. They're just picking Wax, bro, man. Uh, wax. Wax. So much wax, bro. Oh, wax. Can't even, I can't even see a geisha, bro. Like, come on. Uh, I don't know. Should I go rank? You see the wax, like, yep, I'm out, bro. I'm out. Uh, I'm trying to watch. Wax, bro. He's such a safe, like, he's such a safe character, man. You can't expect too much. Well, I know I can't expect that much variety, but there's other meta characters. Like, Geisha's good on Moonlit. She's very good on Moonlit. And Hermit is good on Moonlit, too. And Mary? Like, we haven't seen, we haven't seen Geisha or Mary yet. At all. Like, we've seen, like, what, four hunters today? We've seen Opera... We've seen Opera, Disciple, Wax, and Hermit. And it was is that it? Is that all we've seen? Hold on, is that all we've seen? No, we saw something else, right? <laughs> Am I stupid? Have we seen anything else, everybody? Has that, have those been the only four hunters? I completely forgot. I'm too sleep deprived to remember. Opera, Dream Witch, Disciple, Wax. Have they played anything else today? I honestly can't even remember. I honestly don't even know, bro. Hermit, yeah, Hermit. We saw Hermit. Opera, Hermit, Dream Witch, Wax, Disciple. Five. Yeah, five hunters. Oh, boy. I can't even see a geisha, man. Like, what? This itch is just going to get farmed. She's going to get memed on. Oh boy. No night watch at all, guys. No night watch at all. So sad. Uh, Enchantress. What can you do versus Wax? Why are we seeing so much Enchantress? It's so weird. Like, are they just experimenting with her? Do they find. Do they, is there, like, some something that they see that we don't? I don't know. Alright, well, here we go. Wax gaming time. We got flywheel knee jerk on enchanters. They want her to kite. Uh, we've got bar time knee jerk on uh, psych, flywheel, bar time on Mike, and uh, of course mercenary with the standard bar time tide. That makes sense. So they do want the enchanters to take the kite. Insolence, detention, teleport. Is that teleport? She takes coaster. Mm. She makes that. She can. She can get off in time. She can get off. I think that's teleport. Yeah, that's that's teleport wax. Okay. So it is wax again. And he might switch targets. This is the mercenary. There's no way he's gonna chase a mercenary. Yeah, don't chase a mercenary. He could find the psych. If he finds a psych, he'll probably chase the psych instead. But right now he's still an enchantress who has not yet farmed a stun. He's waxing. Okay, he's just waxing off that stuff. Yep. I don't think he waxed off the window. Oh, no, he did. He's, he's just going around. Okay, going all the way around. First stun is here. And... Pallet. No stun. No little stun. Boop! Alright, well, that's... Uh, that's first presence reached. Wax off Cypher with Wax Bomb. Good, good. Yo, that aim, though. Jeez. Am I gonna stun, stun? Three stack. Yes. Beautiful. Get that distance. She actually... Hold on. Fly with Wax. Fly with Wax. She fly with Wax. Wait, what? No, she missed it. She missed it. No. She missed the flywheel. I thought she fly with Wax. She missed the flywheel. Or I guess if I guess if she did, maybe it was just bad aim. That's why I hate trying to fly with Wax. Because if the Wax are just misses, then you lose. Like, it's like you're... It's like... You're punished for being good. Or, no, I guess it's more like you're punished for them being bad at aiming. <laughs> oh, boy. Oh, Wax. Mercenary is here. One Cypher is done from Mike. That's good. 
The other ciphers are just not that far along, though. Like, she has a kite build, but it, this enchantress didn't even do anything besides a three stun. I guess, like, maybe, I guess maybe the enchantress. Hmm. Is she literally just here to spam, like, two three stacks and die? Is that literally it? Because they're not using baby stuns. He's got full prez now. He's got hot wax. Um. Do we just wait? Do we just sell this? I I don't know. I don't I don't see it. I don't see I don't see the vision. I don't see why we're playing Enchantress. I mean, Wax Artist is good, but like even then, what do, what do we do here? He's got hot wax now. How does this mercenary get this rescue safely? Not even. Do the ciphers are like? Uh, I think he hit that wax bomb. No, he missed that wax bomb. That's good for them at least. He won't expect patroller. Nah, he's got teleport. He's waxing off the cipher that nobody is at. Woo! He just gave them a free rescue by doing that. What the heck? Buddy? Buddy? Wax it off. And... Hot wax. And she's dead. Oh, good stun. Good stun. But hot wax. Boop! Yeah! Yeah, hot wax. We love hot wax out here. Woo! And she's dead. Enchantress, everybody. <laughs> <laughs> Poor Patty. I feel bad for Patty, dude. In the low tiers, she's uh, people are just like she's annoying. She's annoying, which I agree, she's annoying. In the low tiers, she's annoying. In the high tiers, she's bad. She just can't win. Poor Patty. Poor poor Patty. All right, well, four stop loop is here. Mercenary with uh, one elbow pad left. Bruh. <laughs> the fence. The fence blocks all the wax. That's funny. That is funny. That's some good aim. That is some really good aim. I can't even lie. Boop. Wax trick. Wax trick. He doesn't get it, though. He doesn't get it. Misses the wax trick. Shinium, elbow pad. Cyphers are almost ready. Bro decided to chase a mercenary for some reason and did not teleport to a cypher. But I guess oh, he teleported to the cypher now. Okay, here it is. I feel like it's too little too late because now a mercenary just comes over and pops a cypher. I feel like he should have done this way longer ago. Boop. They're, 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 they're basically priming two cyphers. So, wait, hold on. Cypher's not ready. Hold up, hold up. Wax bomb. Wax is so dumb. Oh my gosh. Did you see that? I mean, that was smart. Don't get me wrong. That was smart. He triggered hot wax. So when she pallet slammed him, she took the hot wax effect. And he's just waiting now. He's looking at Cypher's. He's waiting. Yep. He knows it's not ready, so he can share. That was smart, but really dumb, man. Good pallet drop, good pallet drop. Man, that's so dumb. Joker Persona 5, Mike Gaming. Firebomb, beautiful, so we can't hot wax. Yes, and he hit it with him, so that's eight seconds. Breaks the pallet. And... Hot wax is back up, and they just pop. Oh, but she's just dead, though. Boop! Boop! Dead. Teleport will be up in 38 seconds. That's a tie. That's just a draw. A draw! A draw! Versus Wax, bro. Wow. I love Wax artists. Literally, Mike is just spamming his bombs for distance. That's funny. Yeah, tele teleport's not going to be up. That's a tie. That's a tie, guaranteed. Oh, boy. Wow. Wax artist, guys. Most exciting match. <laughs> He's just playing around with hot wax, bro. What the heck? Oh, boy. Well, then. That was interesting. Wax is a tie guarantee hunter, right? Uh, I feel like Wax is a tie hunter with wind potential. Anyways, um, yeah, Wax artist. We... Wax artist. We love wax artist. <laughs> Alright, I'm going back to my memes that are not wax artist related until we get the next match. Also, how, how's it going, Stray? Good to see you. Yeah, I am I am far past my bedtime at this point. Do I know how to play sculptor? Not really. My sculptor is complete garbage. My sculptor is complete garbage. 
All right, people wanted to see fish. What what fish build though? What fish build? What are we bringing? Night watches tie guarantee with win. Yeah, night night watches tie guarantee win potential definitely. But he he's been becoming more just tie. In so detention, no detention, no persona. My goodness. Wait, what map is it? Red Church. I'll give myself uh, no detention in so. Sure. <laughs> Why not? Why not, dude? Alright. Uh, patroller. Sure. Jerry. We're just, we're just using Jerry today, I guess. We're just spamming Jerry. Let me end this poll. Or we're just spamming Jerry's today. Oh boy, Jerry Nyad. Yeah, Jerry. Jerry can definitely drown people. The only issue is I don't know how to play Nyad. <laughs> it's funny that I don't even know how to play Nyad. I still win. But without the detention, though, that, this could be rough. If the survivors even know how to kite Nyad, we'll see. All right, throw a spear. Shneem. Oh snap! Who's over here? Nobody's over here. Unless... No, nobody's over here. Nobody's over here. Alright, well, this sucks. Oh, somebody is over here. Hold up. Hello. The Priboner? Bro, why didn't you say so? Why didn't you say something, bro? You and I were besties. Come on, bro. Yeah, go into the water. Good. Good, 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 good. Come here. I have a secret to share with you. It's called... Oh. Well, it's called death. Hmm. <laughs> it was supposed to be called death, but you don't like death, huh? Come here. Come here, come here, come here. Water off. And, ugh, take that. And now I just spam Jerry. We got that inso. Doesn't matter though. Jerry, go. Sick him. Sick him, Jerry. Do your thing, Jerry. He's going through the pallet, bro. Jerry's broken. Jerry's busted. All right. Oh, cool. So I break pallet and then I kill. Huh? Death. Yes. Power. Jerry. Unbeatable. Oh, great. The chair that I wanted to be there is not there. All right. Well, I guess I'll put this chair or this this prisoner here, and then I'll just water off Church Cipher. But it's probably gonna be finished before I even can. Whee! Here we go. Hi, guys. Water it off. Novelist Gaming. Guys, don't get watered off now. Cheer. Ugh. Take that. Now I just go into water form. Oh. Okay. Sure. <laughs> I'll take this, I guess. Get back in there. And I'll go chase the Priboner. Here we go. Huh. Fish! Gaming! Where are we? Hi, hi, Orf. Hi, Orf. Use your thing. Uh, I missed. <laughs> that didn't water him off? Bruh. Where is the Pribbener? Uh. Where is the Pribbener? Use your thing! There's your thing. Funny. I was wondering where your funny moment was. Huh? Yeah! Nyad Gaming! Wow! Here we go! Spin! Oh, there you are. Hi, buddy. Hmm. I should maybe go back to the chair, huh? That's probably a good idea. I feel like I'm throwing at this point by not camping. Uh, let's see here. Whee! Whee! There is no trail. Awesome, I threw. <laughs> I threw by not camping. Oh boy. Whee! Oh look, it's Puppet Bro. Hey buddy. Lewis Gaming. Lewis, he snapped his neck. He did the thing. Get hit by water, get hit by water. <laughs> That's funny. That is funny. All right, come here, bro. Whee! I said, whee! Good dodge, good dodge. 
But it's fine, I can just kill you. Ha ha! Alright, what cypher is even being worked on? Oh, they're healing. Interesting. Come here, bro. Whee! I am cooking. I'm kind of throwing by not camping. But I'm kind of just doing whatever. I'm just playing for memes. Whee! I don't know where cheerleader is. Where is cheerleader? Nobody's over here. What the heck? Bro, where is everybody? Where are you all? Buddy! Are we just not saving? What? Oh, so they were over there, huh? Um. Oh, oops, I'm throwing. Somebody over here. Yes, there is somebody over here. Is it Novelist? It is Novel, bro. I see. Huh? Huh? Not yet gaming! Oh, so they're just popping. Alright. Jerry! Do your thing! <laughs> no, the next match is starting! Jerry, quick! <laughs> quick! No, his ankles! The next match is starting, Jerry! <laughs> quick! Get him, Jerry! No, sick him! Jerry, come on! <laughs> Confined space for the win! Oh, boy. I missed the Dream Witch match? I didn't miss the Dream Witch match. What? I can't miss a whole match. It's not even... They're playing Embalmer? Okay, hold on. Can they just leave? Please just leave, guys. I need to watch this match. Okay, thank you. Oh my gosh, please, I need to watch this match. Oh, no more memes. Memes are dead. All right, they're playing, they're playing, they're playing Dancer, Anti, Forward, and Embalmer. Um, they're banning C, hold on, this is probably loud for you. Never mind, it's fine. Alright, 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 alright. Alright. Hermit! Yeah, we expected a hermit on this map. Embalmer is interesting. They won't be able, he won't be able to camp. He won't be able to have the camp there. Hmm. I don't know about this comp. Two harassers. Dancer. Embalmer. I don't know. I don't, I don't actually know how this comp... Um, I don't know how this comp does. I can't even lie. No, no Nightwatch, unfortunately. Night, Nightwatch just can't cover that much distance. This this map is just so big. Nightwatch is better on smaller maps. Nightwatch likes stuff like Ever Sleeping, Chinatown. Not so much the big maps. Hmm. Ideally, you prob. Who do you chase here first? Obviously, like you found, you don't want to chase forward or anti, but you're, you're spawn near the targets that you want to spawn near. But do you chase dancer or embalmer? Embalmer's in the two-story area, but dancer's at four stop. Hmm. I actually don't know who you chase here first. Let me get the poll ready though. We got the Hermit. Alva 4K again? Will we see the Alva 4K? That's the big question. This is so cold in my room, dude, I swear. It's snowing out. It is not snowing out. It's just cold. I mean, it is 5.30, so that's to be expected. Okay, do you chase Dancer or... I'll have to chase Dancer at 4-stop. Okay. I guess that's fair. And Bomber sets up Coffin in two-star area. Yeah, it makes sense. And now we connect Cyphers. Yep. And now we chase Dancer. Post it up at 4-stop. Four 4-stop four is a very, very good looping area. Gets a charge on the Dancer. Yup. Sets up Slowbox. Knocks it down for plenty. You're not going to break that? Okay, she just leaves that area. Interesting. Sets up another slow box. Boom, boom, down, down. Stop. No, there's no way you think that was hit. There's no way you thought that was hitting, right? There's no way you thought that was hitting, right? Another spin. Beautiful. Drops pallet. What? Bro, Hermit's broken. That hit? That's crazy. I thought that was nowhere near her. Oh, Blink is up, though. Blink, Blink. Dang. Dang. 
That was a fast down. That was a 60 second ish down. And now he, he now he can spend all his time cleaning up the boxes. He can just clean up all the boxes he wants. That's crazy. That was a glitch. Was it a glitch? I actually don't know. People, people think we're going to see Hermit 4K. I don't know. Oh, Embalmer. Why is Embalmer here? Why is Embalmer here? Okay, yeah, he's just breaking the stuff. Break the stuff. Yep. I don't know why Embalmer's nearby. Okay, never mind. He's backing off. Forward's here. Yep, hits the forward. Tide is used. Beautiful. Being stunned. Nice. Beautiful. Get her some distance, but he has... um. He has Spirit Bomb, so he can catch up literally instantly, so it doesn't really matter. Doesn't even need it. Okay. Spirit Bomb. Are we going to see Spirit Bomb? Yep, Spirit Bomb. Boom! And... Oh, she didn't have a charge. He probably... Yeah, he wanted that charge from earlier to hit, but it didn't. Okay. Well, he got a charge on with Spirit Bomb. Blue Stun, Blue Stun. Nope. Break Pallet first. Slow Box is still here. Stun. Boop! She fly was a stun! Nice! Good flywheel! Good fly Wait. Yeah, that was that was a good flywheel. That was a and she has the coffin now, too. So they don't even have to rescue. But a single cypher is not done yet. Kind of looping him. Oh! Ooh! Hold on! A little, a little, um... Almost coming, like, right behind him, but he didn't even notice. Cutting towards the... Forward cypher. Oh, for a potential harassment. I see. Okay, hold on. Stun. Down, not down yet. Not, not down out uh, yet. But forward goes down if he. Um, I'm pretty sure if he, if he, he has to blue stun here. Ideally, he blue stuns here. Oh, I guess forward could swap. Dang, that catches up so much. No, he, re she, he gets the red stun. Um, or no, that, that's what I meant. I meant, yeah, sorry. I meant use red stun, then, then get the, get the stun with blue, but use red as the color. That's what I meant to say. Because then, then, fo then, um, he hits, and then forward goes down. Yeah, forward goes down. I don't know if forward could have swapped there. I don't know if it was up yet. Um, but two cyphers are done. The cypher progress is very spread out. Alva moment. Didn't get the stun. We're at full pres now, so we got plenty of stuns. We're thinking, we're thinking. Not thinking hard enough, apparently. Blink is up. Do we use blink here? Do we use blink at all? And nope, not not needed, not needed. Down she goes. No forward harassment either. That is a dead female dancer. Yeah, <laughs> I know you guys wanted to break the boxes. I totally get that too. But the thing is, like top players, they like breaking the boxes while people are on chair because it just it saves time. Uh, but there's there's the coffin. So um, she's gonna get coffin into two story. Yeah, tough coffin into two story. And does he just spirit bomb up there? I mean, that's that's the good and bomb play right there. That's the good and bomb play. Uh, bro, bro. Bro? I mean... Did you think she's just not gonna camp up there? Now she goes down. And Antiquarian is there, posted up. This is looking really... Okay, sure. Why not? Um, this is looking really good for the survivors, actually. I mean, I, I guess it's a tie, but like as long as Antiquarian can keep harassing, the ciphers are almost done. They're so spread out good. That's one. Dodge, good flywheel. Alva's charge attack looks so goofy. Alright. Hits Antiquarian. He probably wants to get the anti down so that she can't uh, harass, but... Mrs. Stun, Mrs. Stun. Spirit Bomb. Oh, she said, shut up! Shut up, Alva! You're ugly! Oh, she takes the hit, but shared damage, though. Barely alive. Look at that. She's literally got, like, 90%. That's crazy. Oh, the last Cypher's primed. And they just pop. And he's stuck, he's stuck on Anti now. He's not even on the Dancer. Wait, wait, wait. Woo! Woo! Anti! Yo, she's so cool. That was actually kind of crazy. I can't even lie. I'm going to have to steal that. That was kind of crazy. To completely avoid the Spirit Bomb. All right, damage spreading though, damage spreading, detention damage spreading. Okay, that was kind of crazy. I can't, I can't even lie. That was kind of crazy. Oh, but the dancer is here. She has flywheel. Blink is up. Does he just blink here? Do you just? I mean, he can still trade swap teleport. No more stuns. 
Boop a boop. Dang, the tension damage spreading. Coaster is used. Just teleport. Yep, there's the teleport. Yup, yup. They get the gate open. Oh, but. But. And he's not here. There's no tide left on the team. They just get out elsewhere. They let, they let us get out the other gate. Right? Yeah, they're both heading for it. That's it. That's a three escape. That's a three escape. He can't make it. Oh, Spirit Bomb can get some distance. But it's not enough. It's not enough. He can't get. He can't close in that amount of distance. Yep, that's a three escape. Dang. That could have been a tie, but the Antiquarian harassment was too good. He was like, I, he wanted to... The thing is why he swapped targets to Antiquarian is if he kept going off the dancer, she would have just kept harassing him over and over again. And he didn't want that. The double harassment was actually kind of crazy. Spirit Bomb, woo! I'm gonna go run the coaster, and there we go. Wait, that's just the win. Dang, that's just the straight up win. Uh, wait, that, that's the win. That's it. That's just it. Yeah, that that rebound was really good. That was very very good. All right, looks like it was 50-50 on the 4K, but indeed, that was a three escape. Yeah, a AWG is very good. I was kind of expecting them to win it, so I'm not I'm not super uh, I'm not super surprised. Yeah, harass harasses are crazy. Harasses are just so crazy. And to Crane as well. She's so busted. She's the best survivor in the game for a reason. But yeah, I'm pretty sure that's it for today. I'm pretty sure that's the uh, pretty sure that's the last match. Kind of crazy that we only saw five hunters today, though. How do you feel that the Alva is literally in chat? What? That's not a thing. What? <laughs> Alpha, the Alpha would not be in my chat of all things. <laughs> These are Japan players. Like, I, I, they don't know who I am. <laughs> oh boy. AWG is a pro team while Mai is an amateur. The walk me pretty hard. Yeah, I figure. I, I haven't heard of MY before, but AWG I've heard of before, so. I see. Oh, I see. Yeah, you're the Alva. Okay, I believe. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> totally, totally. Yep, because the first thing you do after losing the game is come to my chat. <laughs> Could you imagine, bro? Oh, no, I lost the set for my team. Guess I gotta go into the Z's chat. Imagine, bro. <laughs> That's the last thing I would expect. The last thing you want to do when you lose a game, dude. Oh boy, they were multi. Yeah, they're... I'm just watching a little bit of Z stream on the side. You guys are cool with that? You guys cool with that? Watch a little bit of Z stream on the side. Oh, that's goofy. But yeah, I'm pretty sure that's all the sets that we got for today. A AXIZ versus WL, and then my versus uh, AWG. Um, yeah, that honestly ended a little bit earlier than I thought it would, but there weren't a lot of ties. It was kind of just um, pre pretty solid, uh, not I shouldn't say sweeps, but pretty solid, like, um, pretty solid games that lean in the direction of one team specifically, which was solid. When I get to co, I'm playing IDV with Z's in the background. Please don't. <laughs> that, would, that would be so embarrassing. Yeah, exactly, dude. Lost the match, pull up to the Z's chat. <laughs> it's the last place you'd want to go, bro. <laughs> is the turning over? I believe it's over for today. This is only day one. Like I said, this is day one of like what, like 25 days or something? Oh, let, let me let me pull up. Let me pull it up again. Let me pull it up again. So the schedule, the schedule looks like this. So today it is March first, right? There's uh, we have tournament, we have uh, more matches tomorrow, the day after, and then we have this every single weekend for like all of March, basically, except nothing on Friday. And then in mid-April, obviously, we have a week and a half of just straight tournament, 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 and then the finals are on the beginning of May. So lot, lots of lots of comp, lots lots of comp. Uh, coming. I'm not gonna stream all of it, most likely. Uh, it's a lot. Of, gonna be lots of um, in video forms, uh, and but also we'll do like watch parties or not, because these are really fun, and it looks like a lot of people had fun watching them. 
especially since there's no English uh, commentary. I'm pretty sure you know, you're going to see YouTubers, um, you know, commentating these matches, but I think it's also fun to do the live streams. But I think um, with that, unless there's another set, there's not another set, right? There's not a, there shouldn't be another set. Mm -mm. I'm, I'm going to like let it play out for like another five minutes. I'm pretty sure that's it for today, though. I'm pretty sure that's it for today. But yeah, I, I should probably go to sleep because, again, I've passed my my bedtime for like four hours so I need, I need to sleep wake up do some kurt gaming and then uh i actually don't know what i'll do after that wow, wow it's opera wow who could have expected that that's crazy opera was the best crazy bro crazy yeah, it looks like a lot of people are clicking off now because the, the sets are over, so... Interesting. Average Terror Shocks 1. Yeah, she did, she got some, she got some, uh, she got some Terror Shocks in there. Opera's just so freaking good, dude. Average Eliminations 4. Wow, that's crazy. Who could have guessed? <laughs> oh, boy. My bad boy. Yeah, I stay up at my bedtime. Alright, I, th I think I'm going to call it there, though. I, th I think that's, um... I'm pretty sure that's it. They they usually stream for, like, a little bit longer. But I'm almost certain that's it. Like, because that was both sets that the, we saw who won. They're not going to do anything. If they're doing anything, it's probably going to be, like, highlights or whatever. So, yeah. Um, I, I think with that, I think with that, uh, we're going to call it a day. Um, I guess I'll just play the alternate cross music as I go out. So yeah, uh, thank you uh, to everybody who... Um... Oh, whoops. <laughs> thank you to everybody who came out to the stream. I do appreciate it. I don't know if I'll do this tomorrow. I don't know if I'll do it in video form or whatever. Um, but this was definitely fun. This is a great start uh, to Koa. And I'm excited to watch more matches that hopefully aren't the same five hunters over and over and over again. Uh, I do like watching these hunters, but I want to see some more variety. Like I'll, I'll even take like... I don't want to say bomb bomb, but I'll, I'll take like Nyad, you know, Mary, the characters I hate fighting. Uh, even some more Disciple. We only saw one Disciple game. But yeah, that's going to be it. Thanks for watching. I'll see you all later today, tomorrow, whatnot. Yeah. Koa time. Yippee. <laughs>